and welcome back for some more wonderful witch last time we completely fucked it up by the fact that there was a I didn't say for a while yeah so now we're back here <laughs> uh, so we are now doing the conspiracy uh, we have taken the coins to the brothel we're now downstairs about to open the door and go fight fight the dude Vincent Trot you're a little elusive here alone. Not wise, Witcher. We'll see about that. I'm wearing Selkirk's armor, you know. Pretty much renders me invincible in a duel. I didn't know you had Selkirk's armor. Mm -hmm. I guess that changes things. <laughs> if you think we're willing to let you go, Assass. or that you can escape through magic trickery of some sort. Relax. I'm not going anywhere. Give me the chainmail and I'll forget everything. Whistling Wendy, your plot. You're Death Mole's hound. I don't trust you. You don't need to. I just need the chain mail. Sure. Not interested in anything else. I'm to remove it. And hand it over. Then you'll be on your way. Indeed. And all will be well. Doesn't sound like my kind of story. How's this instead? I'll kill you, take your swords and gold, and the gods will rain good fortune upon me for ridding them of a filthy mutant. Die! Die! Kill him! Yeah! I'll pull your legs out of your arms! That didn't go well. Tight corridor room and a lot of swords. Yeah, that didn't end well. Reload. Alright, let's try it again. Vincent. Spy! Kill him! The thing is, I have to go out and got uh, health and death modes goons, which does help a certain amount. They're doing literally nothing to take on this game. Search the bodies. Huh. <laughs> nothing useful here. They must have been pawns. Report back to Deathmold. Carriage. All right, can't get out that way. Up oh, here we go. Right, let's try and talk to Dandelion. I fought the Nilf guy. Not another fucking stone. Oh my god! Alright, down the line, down the line, down the line. I'm sure you're over here. Come here, you sod. Hey, you dandelion. Witcher. I found a letter addressed to the people of Kedwin. A letter? Hmm, so? It's your drivel, idiot. Where'd you get that idea? I know you. Not to mention you had the gall to quote me. You're not the only witcher in the world. So, you admit it's yours? Sure it's mine. People have had enough of that pompous clown colluding with Nilfgaard. I decided I needed to open their eyes a little wider. 
Any idea what that pompous clown's going to do when he finds out who's opening his people's eyes? How would he find out? It could only come from you, and I assume, at least I hope, you won't rat me out. <laughs> They're going to kill you. Nah. <clears throat> Why did you poke your nose in this? Henselt approached me to write a few panegyrics about him. You know, singing his praises? Can you imagine that? Me? Writing a political pamphlet? Who the hell does he think I am? <laughs> That's exactly what this letter is. Yeah, political. Possibly. But it's for a good cause. Ooh. Hensel's a prick. Oh, good to know. Talk to death mode. Death mode. How much money do we have saying? Like, three, four. Okay. Oh, we need to go do all that stuff for the, the um... The whole Listen, camp's priest. gone berserk looking for the coins. Well, we see that. Grown lads with their arches in the air. Kind. She you needs your a match. Um. I found Trot and a few other enthusiasts of the square coins. Did you learn who leads them? No. Any survivors? No. Ah, oh, you might at least have spared Trot. I'm sure he had secrets. Any reward for the conspirators? Indeed, a nice round sum per head. I could use the gold. How many were there? Vincent and five others. You killed six men. You and your kind should be isolated. The reward <laughs> is yours. Here. To be fair, your 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 guys did it too. Hmm. From Seaman and Brimstone in the belly of a man. Now, that's going to be to Sheila. Oh, Sheila. No, Sheila's not here. Okay, cool. Right. Wait for events to unfold. Right. So, we are now going to go, I think. Yeah, we'll do that later. Uh, yes, we need to go see the visionary. We'll have to sit it out like hens on their eggs until this mist lifts. Well, we'll go to the visionary because we kind of need to know, know the stuff that he tells I'm us. Done with this cursed place, the bloody comet, square coins. That How much weight was it got, actually? Oh, we've got loads of weight. Uh, actually, okay, very quickly, actually, let's just uh, well, so I've got an idea because we're going to need to kill stuff anyway to sell it later anyway. We know that. Because from last hour, well, from last time we died. God damn it! Um, have these things. I don't need them. Don't want them. And have that. Um, have those two. Um, it might be worth going tonight and killing off a load of the a load of things that can be useful. Uh, for them. Actually, no, we can guess we can do it on the way back, actually. Let's get this into the vineyard the first during the day and give it our sword. Not another fucking stone. What's wrong with stones? But no, we definitely we definitely come here at night because we just get so much good stuff. All the stuff for our potions. All of it. <laughs> Easy. Thanks for your help, Witcher. We were in a tight spot there. The rat yeah. are multiplying like rabbits. We were on our way to see the visionary, bearing gifts and all. But I'll be damned if I'll take one more step that way. Wouldn't be on your way to see him, would you? If you are, give him this coin for us. Ah, do what you will. Any more looks for corpse? Oh, there's something. Okay, cool. Right, to the visionary! And to drink up that bollocks potion of his. Again. <clears throat> I 
sure it might be purely because we know we're going to have some wonderful harpies here in this kind of stuff like that. Hey, you harpies, how you doing? That's two dead, any more? Any other takers? Excellent! That's what I want to see. Hey, vision. I awaited them. They were to come bearing gifts. I heard their cries. Guess they were attacked. If they're not here, they must be dead. No, that's fine. No, they're alive. They didn't want to risk it anymore. Went back to camp. They asked me to give you this coin for candles. This is but half. Why I'll not do more than braid some wicks for this? What do you want from me? I'll not believe you came here by chance. Yeah, you're right. I need to learn some things, and few are willing to talk. Sabrina Glevisig's story, that's what interests me most. Listen, I'll not speak with you until I get my coin, pure and simple. Though I do provide charitable help to the faithful, if you were to become one of them. Indeed, sure. Okay. I've heard a lot of good things about you. All right, I'll become a follower. Wonderful. Listen then, for I'll not. Where? Twi Is that before? Oh. All right, saying. Just trying to get through this, just so we actually get to more game to the actual new gameplay. Ah, oh, oh, I'm gonna say at some point, cause it's just be like, don't do the silly again. Oh, dear. Right, hope more monsters try to kill us. How many more can there be? <laughs> Here one, that's why we can There we go. Another one bites the dust. Oh, one more. Slicey dicey. After I think it's at midnight, I need to do this thing. Where can that go? In yeah, in the evening. So yeah. Perform ritual. Uh, drink potions. Uh, visionary potion. Glug 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 glug. Just what the feck is this? And the chicken. Why a chicken? Out of all the things, why a bloody chicken? And just all these massive phalluses. Just it's ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Wakey, wakey, go up. <laughs> about that one. He certainly had a hell of a trip, Geralt. Alright, and of course, the last important thing, the visionary note. 
Uh, I must be repentant after years spent living in error. No solid soldiery vice was too vile for me. During my years of service, I embraced gambling, alcohol, sloth, lies, and evil profanity. I took lies and not just when ordered. I was cruel. Today I see clearly that I have sunken into the darkness from the depths of which I could not see the light. Miss Sabrina Gledovic's bright and pure, as pure as a goddess shone like a light of a candle in the blackest night. She always supported the soldiers and tried to draw me on the path of righteousness. Yes, I was blind. Right. And back to the visionary. After uh, getting that bonus. Circle of life. Any more harpies to kill on the way, do we reckon? Oh, it was outside once. Wonder how many more. Dreams. Who were you before? Look at. I can't hear. Ten, you're not. I did what you asked. Uh, a strange forest and a giant hen. You may think. You have. You may ask. Cool. Um. Did you hear about the curse? Oh. Sup. Any chance? Uh, let's do this. So long. Huh? Also, to be fair, I don't. So long. There was some trade option huh? there, which I can't now seem to get back to. It's so annoying because trade. Oh. Uh, right. Oh, more. Yep. Yeah. Oh, nah, bloody half. He's out yet doing. Any more takers? Oh yeah. No more takers. Did I pick out the wrong sword? Yeah, I did. That explains why you're still alive, Harpies. So yes, we will go to this merchant, but while we're outside, uh, we're going to meditate until we decide midnight, so it'll be a good time for this. And let's do some monster hunting to get some components. Do a quick save. Alright. Time to kill the fuckers. Neckers! Lovely jubbly. Nothing else? I don't want to move too far away from the course, really because I do tend to lose it in the long grass. Oh, there's some stings. Oh no, you're going to us, that works for me. Oh no, I'm not going to the target. Ah, some rock feet. Loads more. Hello! Come here. Come here, my pretties. Through this grass, you just 
lose track of the corpses. Right, let's give you a help of the soldiers, because last time they were under attack, and that's where I died. Let's hope it's not the same this time. Oh, I need to get past. Soldiers? I can't hear any fighting. Oh, there they are, there is. Don't turn the fire. That's very close. Anything else? No? Okay, cool. Well, I'll say, since the uh, soldier getting attacked this side, I'll go to the other side of the field and see if I'm getting attacked by. I heard a rock fiend. Just can't see the rock fiend. Damn it. There he is. Dead. Dead. Die. Hello, Grace Rock Fiend. Come here. Come on, come jump towards me. Come on. I see him there, there's a couple there, there's three there. Stalking. What's this? Circle of Endurance, yeah, I'll take that. One more rock thing to kill to die. One more rock thing and it will be right. Corpses are so I can track of them. Damn monsters. No, I say I thought I could look at Grace Rock for your resistance, but Boom, boom. 
Okay, let's check out. Oh, fine. I put my sword away. It makes him unhappy. Right, let's check out the men on this side of the field. Have they got problems? Yes, they have. Oh, Christ, I'm not big. This is going to be a lot of enemies to kill. I feel generally sorry for all these soldiers that have to stay out here and deal with this shit. Alright, shoot down again. Right, so there must be quite a few deaths. There's only two of them left. And the sad thing of ah, can't find the bloody corpses because they're all in the fucking long grass. Pretty please. I just like the casual, just like oh, like half hour my 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 loads of our comrades are killed, and now we're just gonna sit down. Guess you do. Oh, more soldiers arrived. Okay, that's cool. Well, as we find, you just keep more soldiers. They're going to deal with all those people. You give up the good work. Right, now we we'll go back to camp and see the relic vendor. Hey, there are. You don't mind. I swear, it seems like it's almost a day again. Like, I thought it was here yesterday. Just looks quite hard. That blue water face is very nice. Oh, no, don't do that. Oh, pardon me, Christ. Don't upset the soldiers. Right, so. In theory, once we talk to this chap, we've actually then now caught up. Relic sat! Right, uh, did you see this? Kisha. You see. Sure. Uh I know you have thought. I need tough luck. What happened? Look out! How much? What? Okay. Da, da, da. The fate. All right. You spite beat. So I. Bah. Yet you. Do you? You build it. I meant not that. You know he did. We were quite. He cracked when they. Then he. So long. All right, so we've done that. Right, yes. So now we're actually back out to where we were previously, where we're about to go and cross the mists for the first time. Or at least that's what we can do in theory. Because uh, what I think there's anything, I don't think anything else just to do. Well, actually, let's just go sell some stuff right now. So. Let's try. What stuff do we have? Like, we don't need all these bloody things. Good God. What do we have, actually? We currently have... Uh, Bull of a plus eight armor. So, oh. yeah, I'm, I'm not interested in any of these other um, trophies right now. So, have trophies. Um... What else is taking up? Stuff in my inventory. Not a lot to be fair, but we got a lot of you know, over there and we got a bit close. Hmm. Okay, so we've got like 45 ish. Um, 
infantry price. Right, so we can talk to Defnard about the race, but we also want, to, I think, can we talk, so, like, okay, last time, around this time, we started to go for the uh, armour. But I, having, having done that for a little while last time, I know that we just need some more money to start acquiring stuff. So let's not do that yet. Let's more wait until we're at least... Well, I say we'll do all the stuff on the other side of the mist because I know we're going to this. This is a brothel, now. not a military. And camp. see how much we'll get, and you know, come back. No talking to the prisoner. How'd you do? I can't talk to prisoner. Yet. I know at some point we can. All right. Hello, death mode. And it's well, late You'll slash have to early. Sit like hens on their eggs until this mist lifts. It won't just. I don't disappear. exactly know what time of day it is here. We'll meet your match. Um. I think I know how to free the king from his curse. Well then, let's get to work. Can't do anything until I have the spear the soldier stabbed Sabrina with. Problem is, it's in the hands of a Scoia'tael commander named Yorbeth. I know this Yorbeth. Are you certain this is the spear? Mm hmm I last saw him back in Flotsam. Yorbeth is in Vergen, Witcher. Along with most of the Scoia'tael from the area, they've joined that peasant girl's insurgency. <laughs> Yorbeth part of a peasant uprising? It doesn't make sense. There's only one way to confirm or disprove it. You must cross to the other side of the mist. What of the other artifacts? Do you know them all now? Not yet. In that case, you must wait until you've learned everything before crossing. It's a dangerous voyage. Not one to attempt twice, wouldn't you say? Yeah, I'd say. Indeed. Uh... No, I would not know that. Looking for mission war hunt. Oh, I simply cannot concern myself with folk, folk tech. tech. The wild. Hmm. I need magic powder to mark out the runes. Are you aware that the formula requires powdered camphor resin? I am. Then you must also know that the resin is extremely valuable. Get Henselt to pay you. I need the powder to do the exorcism, reverse the prophecy, and release him from the curse. You should have said, I'll give you as much as you need. Mm -hmm. Thanks, on the king's behalf. I have one more thing you might find useful. What's that? You asked me for protective runes. I've done better. Take this grimoire, which details many. I believe there's even one for syphilis. <laughs> I've marked my recommendations. Thanks. No. Um. I've got to get through the mist, or I can't lift the curse. I shall supply the white flag when you set out as our emissary. The lass is reputedly honourable. She'll welcome you, invite you to a feast, and with a bit of luck, you may even plough her. You're sick, Death Mold. They say she's very pretty. Peasant girls, not to your liking? God. Not your concern. In case the elves lack an understanding of diplomatic symbolism, please also take this armour. With His Majesty's blessing, I might add. A king's concern can be boundless when his life depends on that of another. I spent Indeed. some time working on this recently. This little marvel guide you through the fog and provide a measure of protection from the spectres. Oh, Thanks. thank you very much, Ethnaut. See you. Right, so we've a few things, have we? Um... Ooh! Still not as good as ours, <laughs> sorry! Um... Yeah, sorry, it's not as good as ours. Sorry, Death Mold. Also, we're working on some other armor to get, so we don't we should just sell that. Um, white flag. Uh, the protective charm. That's cool. Uh, Death Mold's grimoire. Uh, okay, so this is to mark out right. The actual. Uh... Oh, pardon me. Yeah. So we need to mark this out with the with the salt. I'm guessing. Power, the magic powder he's given us. And we've leveled up. Of course, he's get, now we need to go outside, I think. So let's do some preparation before going to the other side. Ah, Zoltan. Good to see you, you old rogue. Why the long face, Zoltan? Everything's fucked. The only sight worse than a sad dwarf is the sight of a very sad dwarf. <laughs> I don't suppose you have any vodka? Might have. <laughs> Standard. Wonderful. Life without old mates and booze is like a woman without a rump. <laughs> if you need a change of climate, come with me. I'm on my way to Vergen. You say that as if you're going to the brothel round the corner. Forgetting about the spectre. <laughs> I may have amnesia, but I remember the curse. Well, all I get around here is non-human midget and the like. 
And I've dwarven brethren on that side. Sure as shit, I'll take Saska over that prick Hensel too. You really willing to help me cross? Of course. Yeah. You know, Geralt, I have a feeling that Vergen's where I should be. I get you. Let's go. I perfectly you understand plan that. to get through the fog? Thought it was suicide to venture into it. Death Mold gave me a protective amulet. Throw it out! I wouldn't touch anything belonging to that dick. Mm. Let me explain. Yeah. The magical potential of the talisman will cause a local interference in the astral projection, creating disharmony where the two dimensions of reality meet. Uh, meaning? The mist <laughs> should part to let us pass. You should have put it like that to begin with, instead of all that crap about astral bodies. <laughs> I'll go with you. Thank you, Zoltan. Oh, I love Zoltan so much. Right, we'll just sell a few things. You still can't talk to the outfit, I think. How'd you do? Hmm, not mind, eh? Hello. Shall we do it later? Alright, let's just... So? Yeah, so we've got this armor that Hensel, that Hensel Deathmore gave us, but we just don't really want it, so... Can you just give us some gold for it? Cheers. Uh, right, can, let's just see what I was having like roll just right now, just to free up some imagery space. Don't need 27 of that, so let's set it up half. Don't need all of that, set about half. Set about half. Knacker claws. Knacker eyes. Knacker teeth. Oh, um, timber. Literally, don't need any of you. Uh, twine. Let's sell some of you. Then look if things are of high count more than anything else. Get rid of some of the claws. I know I need to keep some for later. Uh, oh, this. That. Twenty cloth. I don't really need any cloth. To Actually, yeah, I just thought I don't need any cloth. Um, 25 that does, yeah, get rid of some of that. Cool, that's giving me a bit more space. Excellent, 60, uh, 75, that's a lot nicer. Alright, into the fog then it would seem. I'm glad I've got Zolson coming with us. I can't wait to have some proper ale instead of that. <laughs> drinking the kid when he come. Thanks again, Geralt. It's, you're all good, Geralt, I'm sorry. You're all good, Zoltan. Anything for a mate, especially a dwarven friend. Because dwarven friends are friends for life. Dwarves. Tough crossing ahead of the Sultan. Oh, there you go, boys and girls. Reach Virgin, I'm gonna draw my sword. You sure? Right, so I thought like for us to avoid us all these buggers. I think they keep me spawning. But how many keep me spawning? Is it endless waves? If it is, I'm tempted to just make a run for it. Let's see. Yeah, I 
guys. More, get Okay, a lot of them are parting between us. Let's keep going, Zoltan. Seriously, let's just go. Do I know my way through? I don't really know where I'm trying to go here. Um, let's try over here. This is such a gruesome brutal fight. Ah! Never again. Fucking fog. Look at it this way. You'll be able to brag about seeing the ghostly fog from the inside for the rest of your life. I'd rather brag about how I plowed three wedges at once in my youth. <laughs> Did you, Zoltan? Did you? <gasps> oh, dwarven runes. I'm so happy now. Right. So we've got a few places on because we're on the other side. So plus curse, feel the best box. So I know the city's up here, so let's just go down here just to save the explorer. Oh, not exactly expecting a warm welcome at Bergen. I'm with Zoltan, so I'll get away a little bit more I'm not expecting anything quite nice slash called cordial. Alright, let's see what's up here. Nah, nothing is blocked. I guess it might be open if you choose your path and you start on this side of the mist. It's down here. Ah, oh, this is the mines. The old quarry. Oh, hello. Did I hear you mention a job? Indeed. One very much in your line. I know a collector in Wengerberg. He pays well for all kinds of monster-related curios. Ericus Venom? Necker Hearts? Sounds doable. Harpy Feathers. Uh-huh. <laughs> the raised Why eyebrow feathers? was amazing. I never asked. Got the order and that's that. Interested? What kind of coin are we talking about? Why don't we do a test? Bring me a bundle of fine feathers, for which I'll pay you, and if we're both satisfied, we'll figure things out. He's gonna want more than a bundle? That'll mean a lot of traipsing around. A few more, yes. So? I'll keep my eyes open, mm -hmm. but no promises. I've got more important things to deal with. Mm, no, no we don't. We have... This is all the fun in the world. Oh, yeah, it pays. It's amazing. I've right. got you. One excellent quality. Just what I needed. I'll pay for each and every one. If you're in need of coin, just bring me more. All right. I suppose I've had to work harder for coin in the past. All right, I'll keep it in mind. Excellent. I await your return. Do I have more? Collect 60. Christ, I don't think I've got that much in here. Harpy feathers. I got 22. However, I also know that right down here there are a lot of harpies to kill. Yeah, Zoltan, we'll, 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 do, we'll do that in a bit. It's almost like they're situated this quest right here for a reason. I die here. I'm going to go upstairs. Let's go. Bugger! Oh, bugger! Did it do an auto save on this side of the mist? I gotta hope so.
Yes, it did. At your service. Okay, it's literally just here. Right. Alright, back to getting some harpies. Okay, we're still on the 12 bit, but it's fine. We can get my back. Let's just add on to the and kill stuff. Back down, go. Quite nicely. Now there's another body up here to pick up the feathers from. Boom! There's some more feathers. Feathery, feathery, feathery boy. Feathery boy, feathery boy. Active. Charge. Damn it. I'm not sure what these stones are, but... Okay, so we found a box or a chest of some kind. What about this old door? This looks like a door. No, nope, can't get through key required. Hmm. So we picked up some feathers. I don't know if it's enough of them, but we'll find out, I guess. 
Because he wants 12 right now, but then he asks for 60. So is 60 enough? I know he progressively asks for more, but I have no idea how many he actually asked for in total. Some chickens. Yeah, the medallion went off. So is there anything? Hmm. Ah, it's this rock. Yeah, these rock things. We might not actually find out what that's about. I've got you. Wonderful. Excellent quality. Just what if you? Yeah, yeah, cool. All right. I suppose I've had to work harder for coin in the past. All right, I'll keep it in it's mind. It's coin. It's excellent. I await your return. Do I have 60? No, 55. Need five more. Well, I don't think they're going to respawn yet because it's been too long. So let's let's go actually deal with Vergen. Let's go actually deal with Vergen. As we were supposed to earlier. Zoltan, sorry I got distracted by side quests. I'm sorry. Can you forgive me, Zoltan? I love this little gateway so much. I'd love to know what it says on it. Ah, there it is. Kill him! Edon! Stop! You're making a mistake! Ah, he teleported backwards, it seems. Nothing, nice Sultan. A mistake? Interesting. There's a war on. Don't know if you've noticed. And wars are won by killing foes. <laughs> or do I have it all wrong? The Witcher's a messenger. On his way to see Saskia. Not your typical messenger. Well, I don't know if you noticed. But we had to pass through an atypical fog in which your typical messenger would have shit just before he... Enough! We'll not let you inside Bergen, but you can deliver your message to the commander of the watch. He's stationed by the town gates. Plowing typical elf. Come on, Geralt. Yeah, come on. This is, this is, uh, come on. At the end of the day, come on. This is a dwarven city or hold or not entirely sure the exact terminology in which uh, more, I'm, I know more about uh, History in um, Lord of the Rings style, but but yeah, it's a dwarven home of some kind. So it's surely it's not up to you. Surely it's up to the dwarves. And I got a dwarf with me. I'll give you your this when we happen to see me. That's fair enough. Ah, oh, the gates of Erdland. I just love this city so much. Right. Just around here. A lock, apparently. A locked door. Oops. Ah. Oh, nothing to nick. Oh, that's very sad. Is anything out here? Just plants pick up. So much gold have I got? Mine myself. Four five. Oh, four hundred. Four five hundred actually might be enough to do. Uh, what's the thing? See, this is a city. This is going. We're here. Oh, look at these dwarves. Hello there. Armed crossbow. It's beautiful. Greetings. Why is Geralt of Rivia and Zoltan Chivi? Pinch me, Burton, for I believe I've dozed off while in duty. Could be an illusion, eh? Or some spectres from the battlefield have lost their way. 
Maybe we ought to tickle him with an axe, just to be sure. Nah, tickle with an axe. <laughs> I'm afraid there's no mage out there who can conjure up the witcher's mug, nor the aroma of Zoltan's beer-soaked beard. <laughs> Yarpen Zigrin. Lice eat me if I'm not delighted to see that horrid mug of yours. I love the toys. <laughs> this lad here's scale and burden. Geralt, what are you doing standing there as if you've swallowed a halberd? Got a hug for an old mate? Greetings. Chris has told me a lot about you. We Marigold? Ha! How is the lass? Let me tell you, Scalen. This here witcher's the very embodiment of chivalry. All the silk cups of the world can't hold a candle to him. And you know why? No, but I got a feeling we're about to, to find out. Yep, yeah, got the dwarves telling stories. Me, a knight? I'd sooner call Zoltan a show dancer. <laughs> Well then, listen, everyone. At the time, we were escorting Cadwenny army convoys through the Sherwood forests. Aye, aye, we served Hensel once, though all was for coin. <laughs> Anyways, the Witcher was on the road as well, with Triss and Ciri heading south. The lass, I tell you, was a demoness incarnate. Pure pepper on her feet and healthy as a <laughs> horse. But the sorceress fell ill. Some terrible pestilence held her, gave her the runs. A woman needed to go every five minutes. Lovely. I've never seen anything like it. And I've had my share of gut rumblings. This one time, I roasted an old ailing gerbil and... Oi, you promised us a chivalrous tale. tale. Yeah, as I did. delivering it, lad. In any case, the witcher would carry her into the bushes time after time. He treated and cared for her, cleaned her, bathed her. Aww. Sounds normal to me. A man looking after his woman. It's too much to call it chivalrous, Yarpin. Ha! Ah, wrong. Triss weren't his woman. Not his wife, nor lover. She was sick and in need of aid. And he was an a Not our mission. lover. Oh. Might have left her in some city, oh. might have gone off on his own. But he didn't. Know why? Because oh. he's got a heart of gold. Might get some new water he or something. truly cares. A lad like you, Scalin. Don't know that being a knight's not just about thrashing around in full plate, a long sword in hand. It's not just about fighting duels and winning tournaments. Damn, I missed hearing your bullshit, Sigrun. Hmm. I don't believe anyone else has tried to tell me that story. How is the wee Marigold, anyway? Not great. The Kingslayer kidnapped her. Oh, damn the dogs. That's downright terrible. Indeed I suppose it's no coincidence you're here. No. Um. Triss could be somewhere in this area. The plague. I've not seen her five years, must be. Since that day they proclaimed you dead. Last saw her in Rivia, in any case. From what I've been able to establish, the Kingslayer forced her to teleport the two of them to this area. And she's not on the other side of the fog. What did this Kingslayer look like? A huge, bald witcher. Wears a medallion with a snake on it. Sorry, Geralt. Doesn't even ring the tiniest bell, any of that. I might know something. This Ooh. drunk in Vurgan claims he saw a redhead fall from the sky somewhere among the ravines. And then he said the sorceress Philippa Eilhart came around looking for this woman. Mm. She sent her servant and some peasants to the ravines after her. But they came back empty-handed. Now Philippa's servant maid's gone. Leaving the sorceress angry as a wasp. She even turned one of the plebs into a pig. I spoke to one of Lovely. those peasants. He claims the lass was no servant, but an elf guardian agent. Oh. And she apparently found something in those ravines. Maybe it was Triss. And maybe mm, it no was that likes, witcher. No one Marilha, likes. No the old minx, as Yarpin calls her. Knows she's been duped and can't forgive herself for it. Did the woman flee south, deeper into Edirn? Fucking hell. She came out the main gate not more than an hour ago. Mm -hmm. Headed straight for the fog. Thought she might be out to do some magic probing or whatnot. She knew a bit of magic. She might have crossed. I guess I need to visit Shillard when I get back. Hmm. How's Yorvith? Any chance I might run into him? Minimal. He follows Saskia around like a once-neglected pup. 
eyes on her at all times. He knows how important she is. At least the lass is well protected. What do you seek from Yorma? Last I heard, you weren't exactly chummy. You heard right. But when I last saw him in Flotsam, he had something I need to lift the curse. Even if you see him, I doubt he'll give you anything out of his kindness. Of his yeah. Perhaps Saskia can convince him. I guess I don't have much of a choice. But it's in, in, in everyone's favour that I lift the curse. Any idea where I might find the Dun Banner? Try the Nether World. The whole unit was cut down during the battle three years ago. I meant the unit standard, which symbolizes death. Ah, that makes it a lot easier. We buried it with the remains of the Kedwenis. Where? Just outside Vergen. I'll mark it on your map as the road could get confusing. Strange things Thank are afoot in those crypts, Witcher. Kidwenny ghosts scaring off our folk. That would be normal since they were invaders. But one's some kind of amateur historian, asking all that venture there about the battle and the Dun Banner. Ah, it. might be worth Thanks. knowing about the battle in detail then. I have to see Saskia. To what end? To dispel the mist of wraiths, I need a few magic artifacts. What's Saskia got to do with that? Her sword is one of those items. And what do you suggest I do? Yorvith and Saskia banned us from letting strangers in. And here are two old mates come over from the other side who want just that. A lose-lose situation if ever I've seen one. Indeed. That ought to be easy to get around. Cow pies ought to be easy to get around. Yet we don't always succeed. <laughs> I'm staying here, Yarpen. I want to join you, enlist. Will you have me in the Dwarven Brigade? Will I have you, Chivi? Will I plow and have you? Why, I'll make you a fucking commander, you cocksucker! <laughs> Problem solved. <laughs> Scalen, you're my witness. Zoltan's no longer a stranger. Aha. Uh -huh. All right. Now I'll introduce you to Saskia, and you can try to clarify the story with a sword for her. Or whatnot. Don't Indeed. you fret about the sword, Geralt. I promise to ascend to the fucking heights of oratory. Be soft as a mink. Cautious as a novice strumpet. I'll get you that blade if I have to shave my beard off. All right, then. See that, Scalen? We were headed for a tragedy. <laughs> now we're headed for a comedy. comedy. <laughs> ah, youth these days. Um... Lacking hope and heart. You know what Zoltan and I saw at Brenner, lad? To us, there's no such thing as the impossible. It's nice to talk to you all, but we've got things to do. Ah, that's life. Open the gate. I've got to fetch me a certain sword. Wait a minute. If by some miracle you obtain that cursed blade, I'd advise you not to parade it out the main gate past the squirrels. Got another solution? There's another passage. I'll mark it in the Witcher's map and show you myself. Sound all right to you? It does. Yeah. In the meantime, I'll look around for that flag. That works for us. Prime, I'd say. Off we go then. Indeed. Well, thank you very much. Witcher, finish your dealings, friend, before they turn into real problems. Oh, Vergen, I love this place. Love the hold. Very dwarven, in a good way. It's awesome. Right, let's see what little bits we can explore. Acquire the head of a young Cool. Key went on close. Tents. Some bobs. Can we go into this little house? Then we can nickel the stuff in there. Next up. Can't seem to get the last one. That's one thing. Uh, that's it for us in here. We'll go sell some stuff to people because it's like. We won't have an opportunity to get any of this again because it's probably only going to be over this side of the mist once. Hello. Let's try. Books and stuff, which is good. Well, sorry about the sounds, but I need to read up on my history. Of the Battle of Nilfgaard, Battle not Battle of Nilfgaard, Battle. Uh, that happened three years ago. Yeah, going too much weight. That's fine. Can I talk to you? No. 
Oh, no. What time of day is it? Okay. Uh, let's go to noon then. Wow. There we go. Got a shot. That's weird. Hello. Oh, another traveller. Hmm. From to. Had it. So. Business. Just what? I a whip. Well. well. Um. We oh. Oh God. Right. Let's just trade. Uh. Right. This axe, I don't really want it. Even though it's quite good, but this little draw, this little draw and therefore is amazing. But yeah, just don't care about that right now. Don't want that, do you want that? Don't want that. And other bits and bobs. Don't really want that leather to be fair. Iron's easy enough to find. Alright, let's uh other bits can we pick up. Greeting! Greeting! No. Oh, axe guard. Don't bother. Love it. A dwarf witcher. I thought we had a basilisk in the basement. I like that idea, dwarf witcher actually sounds awesome. Witcher, finish your dealings, friend, before they turn into real problems. Right, uh, so acquire the various bits and bobs. So, we have things marked on our map now. Um, one appears to be over this direction. So I can't get past the gate. Let me park. Let me go this way, it is. So I believe this is going after the Dun Banner. Can we get... no? We can't get any further into the city or four things. Oh, is this a game of then raid all the way? Yeah. Cool. Just steal all the stuff, get our way. No compunction of what actually might not belong to you. Oh, get out. Can't even get that. Yeah, I can't even get some of these. I can tell just not close enough. Bit of bad game design there. Right, I'm just going to go back briefly because oh, there more. Christ, more weapons. Yeah, because I'm now running out again already. Jesus. Okay, can we go to something there? What's in there? Pick up what we can. Yeah, yeah, I know. That's right. Let's then go and drop. Or oh, we're just going to walk back to the bloody city. <laughs> How long is it going to take us to walk back to selling? Because apparently we're going too much bloody stuff. How quickly your inventory can fill up in this game is insane. Oh, come on, Garrow. Ah, oh, fuck, sell it. Right. Drop. 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 Do this one. Alright, go on, get it up. It's annoying, it's not even like a proper rug, it's like just a jog. I mean, I suppose it's kind of like, oh, it's a constant speed I can I can always keep at. Mad. Rooted in square. Right, let's trade. You can have all this stuff I've stolen from you guys. And that iron ring. And yeah, some of that can sell up. And have the cloth. Picked up some wood as well. Okay, some iron as well. Leather, half the leather. Timber, have the timber. Have some of the twine, not a lot to be fair, but some of it. I say you look a lot healthier on the side of money now. I've turned up to 5k of gold. 
It's going to be very useful for when we get across the other side of the mist. And we pick up all our new gear. Right. Now, very quickly, where did we drop the stuff? Pick that up. Also pick that up. Also, keep forgetting, I want to. I should tell, start selling through these ingredients I'm getting, because my inventory must be absolutely chucked, chucked through with them. It's a shame there's no one else to interact with it, actually. It's, I get why, because they want to save it for when you do the Euro path repairability and all that. Uh, yeah, because. I'll keep the 55 back, because I know I'm going to need that. Actually, I don't know as much as I thought. That's fine. Okay, cool. Never mind. Right. Off to the uh, tomb to pick up uh, the stuff of Ban of Ban Dada. Also, actually, before I forget, meditate. Not meditate. Wrong while go up. Character. Did I pick up extra? Yes. Cool. Three points to do. Oil duration. I don't really do oil. Is there anything else up here? Oh, I drink an additional potion. Actually, I quite like that. So I'm going to get that just to get to that. Um, additional potion. Yes, that's that is useful. Damage reduction when poisoned. Oh, that's right. Uh, what's this? Damage dealt when poisoned plus five percent. No, no, no. Who care about the whole poison stuff? That's cool, to be fair. Right, anyway, let's actually, let's put a, a point at least in. Don't use Ard a lot, to be fair. He's Axie, to a certain extent. Eh. Sign damage, let's go for that. It's a nice generic one. Can it still go up to the same tree? Saying we need to kind of more evenly disputes our points rather than just putting them all to every one to one thing. Right, the old gate. Let's go to Virgin. Ow. Spot my wrist. Um, yeah, we've got plenty of room in our inventory. That's what now, before we actually enter the crypts, I do need to make sure we we check the, our knowledge on the battle. Not battle of Renner, it's the, the battle that's, that's outside here three years ago because I'm saying there was a, I'm saying there was a, something asking about details. I'll make sure I got the details right. Oh, it's like this weird place of drowners in the night. But it is not in the night, because I'd like to explore it in the day, ideally, when I can see what's around, what's going to come up against me. Get rid of the crossbow guys first. Now I can give you a view. Yeah, but I'm not an elf, mate. I don't even notice that. I've not got the ears. Oh, ow. See, that's what I really like cross people. Oh, harpies. Harpies. Harpy. Well, I don't think that's the 
back up here now. How much do I keep? Oh, there's a necker. I don't mind if I do. Can you go away, please, man? Wait, wait, come back. Shiny, shiny, follow the shiny, follow the shiny. Right, what was up here? I'm not sure. pick up. Oh, the thing's cross. Oh, go to the tower. Ooh, fancy, fancy. How many more can there be? I care a little about how many more there are, to be honest. I don't really mind. I can sort them out easy enough. And jump! Yay! Well done, girl. You were self to jump in. Yeah, scales are really nice. Jump in those again. Oh, oh, oh. I say they get quite a say. They're not individually that sharp, but when they're turning around you, they start taking their toll on the side of the hits. Any more? Any more takers? Rights of Melitae. Ah, I see that. Karen, the horrors of the war, rock fiend, drowners, textbooks, report from Tyler. Ah, that's. That's all right. Right. Let me get up here. Jump again. Magical crystal. I don't know what that's useful, but we'll take it. We've maybe gone a little bit um, hard on trying to get things early to a certain extent. Right, I don't think we can jump in here because that's the path that we all used. What about over here? Nope, can I get down to be honest? This oh, neckers! Excellent! I do like the neckers. All of the stuff I can get off them. Right. Let's just uh let's 
Shout back over. Shout back over. So, no idea what this is for, but we've got to think about. To the crypts, which are, I believe, still in this direction. Uh, put on, uh, put on some weight, Gary. Right, we need to worry. We need to worry. Right, we need to. You know, not, not sure we don't drop too much weight. Right, and all the neck has just spawned here. Remember it, Gary. I can't see them. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, or if it's just a thing. What's the plants picking up? I have to admit, it's very lush over this part as well. Not exactly on the whole what you tend to uh, attribute to a sort of dwarven type setup. What's up here? This is just another route. Oh, I think it's just another route through. Oh, right, yeah, because you could go that way. This way. Okay, it's just literally just a few different routes around the area. Okay, that's fine. No problem. Right, this looks like the crypt that we're supposed to get down to. Well, obviously still used with the candles still burning. So it's very quickly. Let's need to go to this quest arm. Apparently, that's crystal. Um, locations. The battlefield. Yeah, I might need to do some reading up on that battle, actually. Certainly not some people talk about it, various people. Right, well, they, well, they can be pushed in, can't they? I can see even through through them. Right. Ah, oh, Boo! Oh, bloody hell. Right to dig out the way rapes us. Really not fun. That one killed. That one is killed. She was down and just going for the massacre. So I don't know exactly what we're looking for in here. Oh no, the, the banner. Done banner. Oh, there's more. Real question is, I don't, I don't mind to be fair, but do we get any experience of killing all these guys? What's he been doing here? Uncover. Why are we uncovering corpses, get up? the entire team first. Very briefly, because we might very quickly work out actually what we need to do. I'll wait for magic to go. Oh, Dalian's going, that's always a good sign. Good sign, I mean bad sign, bad sign. 
Okay, let's see if there's that side of it, but since we're going stronger this side, keep on this side. Oh, I just wait for my magic to recharge. Well, correction, I have to wait for my shield to go off so that it can actually recharge properly. Get him! Get him! Get him into the corner. And that's it. Oh, I've got my shield. Cover any bodies yet until I work out why I would even want to encounter any bodies. Chest, no. Okay. Oh, across the bridge. Oh, look at that right bridge on that side, right. So if we take an immediate left, yeah, we can get back, we can just clear out and order because then this is what back up here into that bridge which is okay cool oh apparently this is where it is or is this just a marker generically to the tomb I mean, it might be a generic target just for the tomb Target the ones that are low health. Oh, there's another one. How many more can that be? Good question, Garrow. Answer to bloody many. Right, what's through here? So once we've explored all the actual lands, we're going to do it again. Who oh. are you, and what do you seek? Geralt of Rivia. I seek the standard of the Dun Banner. Oh, God. Who are you? Eckhart Hennessy. Handsome and color bearer of the Dun Banner, the best force to issue from the land of Kedwin. Um, I'll come back. It's nice to chat and all, but I think we'll finish this another time. Ah, kill the wraith or deceive it. Uh, it'd be easier, I guess, to deceive it, but. And like he said, it was going to ask questions. I said, I can't remember if I have anything about. About the Dun Banner actually on me. Was there anybody that existed who served in the Dun Banner? Oh, I think there was. Oh, I haven't talked to him properly yet. Oh, I'm such a. I think. Characters. Oh, I think I know who it is as well. Uh, the core of the arms made up simple soldiers on commission the last quarter of the dumb banner <laughs> Oh yes I might get to get <laughs> Oh this might mean I have to go back to back through the mist and come back. That is a great that's not gonna be fun. Okay, quick save. I'm just gonna see if I can actually talk to him and see if this works. Who are Geralt of 
I served you may not Dunbar, remember me, but, but I, I remember, remember you. you. I served in the Where Dunbar. from? I served in the Dun Banner. Liar! I fought beneath its standard at Brenna and at Vergen. The Battle of Brenna. Ah! The Nordlings shoulder to shoulder against the Black Ones. The Redanians led by De Reuter on the right, Natalis leading Tamaria on the left. The splendid sight was it not? No, Natalis was not on the right, was it? It's nice to check. Let's check that. What's to know actually with the Battle of Brenna? Do we have any entries for that as a. Do we have a book about the Battle of Brenna? I don't want to. I don't want to have to kill it if I don't have to. Okay, we might come back to that actually. Then that's how we do it. We'll come back to it. Okay, so I think I just need to search the bodies. Okay, let's do the other bits then. So uh, let's. Tr so we know where the dumb banner is. We just have to. Think. So we need to go talk to that chap. Um, we also need to find out about the battle brother from somebody. We went there. Alright, uh, well, back to what is it? So, that's the dumb banner which we can't get yet. Well, we can, but I'm just. I'm, I want to spare him if I can, you know. No, he just wants us to meet his fellow soldiers again. So, he was. So, uh, that was a question. That was. He is effectively trying to deceive us, like, if we really remember the dumb banner, we would remember where we were. And you would, I expect, if you as soldiers, you would kind of remember that kind of thing. So I need to find out about Battle of Brenner and this guy here. So I guess, like, who commanded? Because John de Talis was at Brenner, he did command the Sumerian forces. I just don't know what side of the field he was on. Ooh, yod. Ooh. Right. Let's do what else we need to do as we hit up on this side of the mist. Let's go follow the other pointy arrow. Also, I think we've got the half first. We can go do that. To be fair. So how much money have we got actually in the bank? Just, just issue five pounds to go. Yeah, definitely probably work considering I'm getting the new armour. I definitely want to have new armour before sorting out the curse with Hensel. Well, actually finishing it. <laughs> so no, uh, no doubt we're a big fighty fighty with um, some wraiths. And so it's just like, right, I want my better armor and my better swords. Right, so let's follow this other marker. Where are you going to lead us? Town, it seems. Even it seems perhaps it's kind of towards over here. No, on the other side. Okay, so we have to go back around. Sighted, she knows. Hey, it's God's hell. It's nice not shooting at me for once, to be honest.
let's deliver the man's harpy feathers. I'll just leave over there. Cool. More harpy feathers, just like you wanted. Mm -hmm. Good work! Why, it's even a pleasure to pay you. Good. I gotta admit, that might have been the strangest job I've ever had. Well, it's hardly done. Um, let I'll me hear. hear you out, but I've got a bad feeling about this. Mm -hmm. I need a few more feathers. Who is it that needs them? You or this collector? But he does, of course. Pretty suspicious. Why didn't you tell me how many I was supposed to bring right off? I, I needed to see the quality. Just a few feathers more. <laughs> I'll pay extra. Decide. If you're gonna pay extra, Let me think about it. Collect eight more items. Eight more. Do I have eight more? Yeah, I do. I've got some more feathers. Sleek and untattered. I hope that'll do it. I look at them and select the finest. There's your payment, <laughs> with a small bonus. What am I supposed to do with the ones I have left? Whatever you wish. I've no need for them. Farewell. All right. Visit if you're long later. Okay, I will. Fair enough. But I'll do this. Um... Uh, yeah, me. Was it that or was it a different quest? I was, doing, I was doing a different quest, I think. Uh, kill the rep receiver, assassin of kings. Yes. Here we are. Right, let's put this all away. So, how much money does it get up to now? So, we're at 5,000. Why don't we get that? Ooh, 600 quid. That's quid. <laughs> Christ. Britishman talking in his money. No. I don't know. But 600 is not bad. Let's get a bunch of gold. Gold. Gold! Alright, what's up here? I think that cool quiet. Don't have a key. Uh, bloody luck. Don't unlocked. Ooh. Search the tunnels with Zoltan. Okay, cool. Well, firstly, I need a drink of potion. Four. Oh, that's awesome. Right. Yeah, I have a cat. And, okay. Since we're drinking potions, let's have a swallow as well. Sort out. I know I'm probably, I'm probably gonna need it. Let's be honest. Ah, there we are. Ah, knackers. Always nice to see some knackers. Always nice to pick up some bits and bobs as well. Occasionally, because it seems a good way of doing it. Uh, this can be a fun combination of trying to get to soldier in these tunnels. Oh! To make potions off and lots of things to sell to make more money. Oh, sure. The Dun Banner. The book. The Dun Banner rose to fame during the last wars with Nilfgaard at Kedward in Light Cavalry Regiment. Initially it patrolled the area around Ben Glen, called cool to the front. It proved its mettle during the in initial incursion into Upper Eden. But it was the Chronicles of Battle of Branner who made the unit famous because of his great experience. 
chapter. So this is the data of the dumb battle, once again, led by Hensel, Free into the Ed, and this time it suffered a crushing defeat at the hands of an tense Mastrusi ally. No less, the sorceress Sabrina Glesovic decimated beyond resurrection. The unit was never reformed, and its characteristics, cloak and beaver skin caps, which once bred terror to the hearts of Kennedy Wolves, became a thing of the past. Though there remain identified marks, which some units, few survivors, members of the unit, recognise each other. Yeah, pretty sure our, our mate has that hat, doesn't he? Might have to get that hat off him. Go that mate, just just need it, just give us the hat. Give us your hat. Alright, I don't see a way through here. Go up. Alright, so back up. Sorry, phone was buzzing at me. Very brief there. Hello, Knackers. Oh, crap, so much iron, we're going to fill up our inventory of all this. Right, so we came from that way, so let's try this way. Might have to drop some of this iron, I have to admit. Might be too heavy for us to take back. Going too much weight, yeah. There you go, the game recognised it finally. Okay, let's drop the trousers because they're different too heavy, and yeah, let's drop that. That'll do for now. Hopefully, Zolson won't be too far, far off. That's really good. What on a holy thing is happening? And where is it happening? I could literally not see any enemy. Oh, it's upstairs. Okay. Um, oh, hello, Beastie. Die. Let's, um. Grind this shit up. Cascoon key. Oh, okay, that's kind of a bit useful. In theory. Key is always very useful. And Zoltan. And. Oh, you've got a lady friend. What's down here? <laughs> oh, I have a lady friend. Ah, oh, what's down here? Okay, I'll 
I'll pick up those bits and actually go see what that's about. <laughs> oh, she's like, oh, it's down here. Oh, it's more hunters to go. Sultan, you were supposed to bring the sword. I failed, Geralt. That was not the best idea, Witcher. Dwarves are poor liars in general, and that's especially true of this one. You know everything you need mm -hmm. to know? Yes. You need the weapon to lift the curse from Henselt and free the souls of the Fallen. A lady, I know you're at war with Henselt, but the curse threatens Vergen as well. It's a field of uncontrollable magic energy. No Indeed need to exert yourself. I know this. The sword shall be yours. Just like that? Yes. So is this Saskia? I'm glad to help and thank you on behalf of the Vergenids, the souls of whose loved ones will finally be granted the peace they have so long deserved. My lady. I am no lady. My name is Saskia. Saskia, I'll need some time to lift the curse, enough for you to fall back. The Scoia'tael and peasants can't hope to defeat a professional army in open battle. That's We've so drawn true. deeper into Edern. You underestimate them. Looking to be another Elleryn? Do you want them to die with your name on their lips? You know that's what'll happen if there's a fight. The fighters will die quick deaths. But then Henselt's men will enter the town. They'll spare no one. They'll kill the men, rape the women, turn the beautiful ones into slaves, and torture the rest to death. <laughs> I have seen conquered cities and know the risks. Why do you aid Henselt? Why do you risk your life to lift this curse? It's mm. not up to me to judge rulers, yeah. good or bad. But the, the, cur the curse, curse needs, needs to be lifted. Dispelled. Not much room for politics or moral judgment. Yes, I know. You're a hero. Folk tell stories about you in taverns, and troubadours describe your adventures in poems. Line but you've never mistake, known so. the whip. Your children have never lost hands for stealing apples. You know not how it is to serve at a heavily laden feast table while your family awaits famished at home. You fail to understand me, for you make no moral judgments. I have no such restrictions and can thus warn you that Henselt is scum. Be cautious, take care of yourself and your friends, and I'll not heed your advice. We'll not flee, we'll not surrender. That's your choice. Farewell, Saskia. Farewell, Witcher, and know that I hope never to have to face you in battle. You can be sure of that, Saskia. I only fight monsters. See you, you old prick. Don't let them kid when I do, and don't get killed. That goes for you too, Sultan. Farewell to you both. <clears throat> Saskia, I forgot one wee thing. Geralt wishes to meet with Yorveth. He's got dealings with the elf. I need the head of the spear used to finish off Sabrina as she uttered the curse. Hmm. Yorvith had it when we ran into each other in Flotsam. He lost it playing dice. Galen <laughs> now has the spearhead. The young Verdon is a gambler, an addict, and perhaps Vergen's top sharp. You should speak to him. I Yorvith shall. put that spearhead up as a bet. When it comes to getting folk to sit down <laughs> to the game of poker, Scalen can be convincing. His pack is bulging with treasures. You'd be surprised. All one dice. I won't need convincing. We'll see how he does against me. Farewell to you both. Thank you very much. Uh, return to the surface. I don't think we want to stay on the ground particularly, get to be honest. Right. We shall... Ooh, what's that? So we have got one of the symbols. Excellent. We're still lacking uh, the dumb banner, but I'm saying we ha I think we'll have to go back across the mist and talk to our friend. Now, we're going to return... Ooh. Loads. Okay, we're going to go first talk to the merchant and the bloody free elf room entry in space a little bit. Right, we said to return to this guy later, so, hello? Yes, you're beautiful, my queen. Oh, God! My lady. <laughs> you're a wondrous sight. <laughs> All in your nest, envy you. <laughs> wow. I don't need this feather. Please take it. <laughs> nice it's weather. warm for this time of year. It is colder usually, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> the mages must be up to something. Oh, yes. They devise with experiments. Always changing the world. 
They'll botch it one day, and it'll be the end of us, I tell you. Okay, I guys. shudder to even think about it. What the hell? I want you to have this feather. I have no use for it. Uh, no, thank you. Uh, neither do I. Uh, neither does this collector, you mean? Yes, yes. Uh, neither does... <laughs> oh, his nails are red, too. I a specific number of feathers. Uh... Perhaps to match the number of empty spaces in his feather album. Indeed. Don't Indeed. see how that would matter. It's immensely important. Well, I guess I don't know much about collections. Uh, is there an actual genuine new phase of this quest? No, this quest is complete. Okay. I was like, there's a new phase of the quest. Go back again. And she's like, oh, Christ. So that's where we wanted the feathers. Oh, nice. Nice one, buddy. Right, let's go sell some of our bloody shit. All that iron and stuff we picked up in the mines. It's weighing us down an amount. And we'll track on that quest of Spirit Destiny. Then we need to okay, we need to okay, we need to then read up on the Battle of Brenner a little bit. Who could tell us about the Battle of Brenner? Dantilar might be able to, to be fair. Um, no, let's get it from a source, like from Hensel, because Hensel is still to us, absolutely. Um, get it from a nice, easy, confirmed source. Oh, I love that banner as well. It's glorious. Oh, can you tell I'm in love with this dwarven hold? Beautiful. Right, I'll talk to you in a minute. I'm clearing out my inventory first. Hello, you. Let's trade. Right, what do I have? What do I have? Uh, you can take... Uh, well, I don't actually need all these anymore. I know I need some of this actually for special armor, so actually, so I'll... S actually, yeah, that's it. Don't think I need any of these, so let's sell off. Use... But uh, perhaps I need, let's say, ten, so you can have all of that. Um, Necker, yeah, I don't, I don't need that many. You get about half. Necker eyes once again. I have about half hearts. Have about half teeth. Have about half twine. And that gives me some free space I need for a while at least. Right, let's talk to you, no doubt, gambling dice. I heard you have the head of Yorvid's spear. I do indeed. I could use that spearhead. Not a chance in hell. It's my trophy. Won it off the greatest killer among elves. In certain circles, that makes me a hero. What were you playing? Dice poker. I've rolled a few dice in my time. Do I hear a challenge? Indeed you do. I trust you'll not ask me for a handicap. Though I must warn you, I aim to be merciless. Curse or no curse. Let's begin. Hmm. Put some money down. Uh, ooh, three sides. Well, don't just ruin all those two. Don't even need to look at us over there. Makes a little difference to actually what I'm going to re-roll here. A four and a two. And what do I lose to? Uh, oh, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, that's fair enough. You lost Witcher. Like that fellow, uh, what was his name? Blaskowitz. Who was he? Another who sought a magic spear of fate or destiny. Uh. Old story, don't in any case. If you care to drop, let's 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 play again. I say it's probably playing for so little. I'm going to be honest. All right. Uh, one. Damn it! Essentially, I've, I've literally got nothing. Um, keep the six, and let's hope I re-roll some dice bits. Uh, pair of sixes, I think that's it. And a pair of fours. Woo, win! 
Right, what that's been. Play like a true sharp. Almost like a cheat. But true to my word, the spearhead's yours. Thanks, Scalen. I heard you have a few more interesting trinkets I could win off you. I could find something. Oh. Let's see what be my Yeah, if he's got more stuff to win off him, fuck it, I'll give it a go. Um, three fives. Don't need to resign. Nice. All right, gonna win something else. Off, I? Damn it! You win. Scalen, my prize, the sword of the warrior princess Xanthia. Good enough. Oh I'd yes. Say so. It's yours. If you'd like to roll again, I'm always willing. Okay. Let's see what you can give me this time, if anything. It might be a limited stock. What stuff he's got for me? Uh, one, two, three. I'm missing the four. Uh, I thought we'll be getting it. Let's just roll those and hope. Yeah. Ha! I. I see this here and come back. Let's see what a beam. This is the kind of thing I go, oh, it's a nice sword, but it's uh, not good enough. <laughs> Sell. Uh, Reroll those because I've got a matching pair of twos and we've got twos. A pair of fives. Oh, nice. Woohoo! Right. Any other little prize for me? Just Damn it! You win! What's my prize this time? The wool coat of a corporal of the Dunbanner. Oh. One of a kind. And truly sought after by collectors and aficionados of military mementos. Nice. Where did you get these things? I played dice and won them. Now I played and lost. I'll play you. That's no it. More. I'll play you no more. Don't get mad. I'm not. I'm just not fucking playing you no more. <laughs> nice. So what we got here? Oh, it's a quest item. Oh. Bet that's gonna be useful for somebody. Uh, right, this sword. Oh, that's not a bad sword to be fair. I might check how that beats out the other one on the design. Anyway, up to six k gold actually. That's really not bad. Right, back across the mist, guys. Do a quick save because we need to get we need to talk to what's his name about the dumb banner. And the Battle of Brenner and the battle that occurred here in Eden uh, three years ago, where they decimated. Because that's what his corpse is going to be cared about as well. Right. I'm literally just going to run across this battlefield because there's no point in trying to kill all these ghosts. They just keep respawning. Here we go, Garrop, into the mist. Wonder how many more will turn up. Literally no point, because he'll just keep respawning on my ass. Just run for the kid when he can. It's not quite easy to like, get around to the right bit. Yeah, it's like up here, isn't it? I'm looking for like a blue mist. Die, die. Oh, 
Oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, Garrow! I swear it was over here we were on. God damn it. Maybe we can't go back until we completed this side of it. Maybe we... Ah. Oh. Yeah, okay. I don't think we can. Kill the race. Right. What do we know about Battle of Brenner? Battle of Brenner was against New Guardians. It was New Guardians. Uh, versus the North, the United North, under John Natalis. It was Temerian. Uh, it's not going to go well. I say I think potentially, uh, like I said, I don't think I can get back across. Maybe that's why I was given that symbol, so I can do it that way. Uh, okay. Let's go. We'll try to deceive the race. If we can't, we might have to kill it. Which is annoying because, like, I don't know how actually it's going to work. So, like, you know, of course, by actually settling the wraith down, of course, it's a lot happier. Because by actually, you can lift the curse. Uh, but does, but does like killing the wraith also have the same effect? Can it still send it to the afterlife, or is it just dispel it for an amount of time, not actually lifting it as such? I don't know. Let's see, but the yeah, all right. Back to the ghost, and let's try our best to see it. But we also now have got the symbol of the dumb balance, and that might help. It might give us a free. Hopefully I won't need to kill a little roast in the tomb again. Try and get our best lucky hat on. Let's just do a save before we start talking to it, just in case. So, hello. I see you've returned. Yes. Indeed. The Battle of Brenner. 
the Nordlings shoulder to shoulder against the Black Ones. Yes. The Redanians led by De Reuter on the right, and Atalus leading Tameria on the left. A splendid sight, was it not? I'm gonna okay. The fact that we've got the options, I'm just like I think it's like you've got it wrong, you've misremembered. You're mistaken. The Redanian regiments were on the left. The Temerians took the center. Correct. Perhaps you speak the truth. Try me again. Tell me, for this you must know. Who was chief commander of the Nilfgaardians at Brenna? Brenna. Oh, I remember reading about this. It's nice to check. I remember reading about this somewhere. I just don't know where, or if I've even still got the book. God damn it. Right. Yes. Don't Tell take me, a guess. For this you must know. He was the commander. Who was chief commander of the Nelf Guardians at Brenna? Marcus Berebant. See, I def I've not heard that name. I've heard Elo Talabad, but it might. I think it's Ellen. Fuck it. Elan Trey. You wear the wool coat of the Dun Banner. If not for that, you would be a dead man. Reads right. Try once more. Tell me, for this. Menno Cohorn. I am beginning to believe you. Whoo! Menno Cohorn. The repulsive head hound of the Nilfgaardian pack, but a great commander. He will again let the Nordlings blood. Would you agree? Well, he's dead, isn't he? He killed himself. Remember, at the end of the battle, he killed Your himself. Your memory has suffered after death. He, he deft. Cohorn perished at Brenna. You are vigilant. I could not deceive you. Because I am of the Dun Banner. Perhaps you did fight at Brenna. It was so long ago I may have forgotten you, but Vergen is another matter. I can't answer for the state of your memory. You are right. Memory often fails us after death. I cringe to admit I've forgotten who commanded the armies during the Battle of Vergen. Perhaps the most important day of my life. And the last. Be so good as to remind me. It wasn't death mode. Yeah, no, it's Vandalin, because it's the point we're getting we're getting the artifacts of those times. We have Sutlix armor and that's magical. So yeah, it was Death Mold wasn't around. Uh no, okay, he would have been around, but he wasn't commanding the battle. Hensel and Devan weren't commanding the battle. It wasn't the king. Seltkirk led Edern. Vandergrift led us. Well done. Not all know that. Some believe that the kings no. commanded the armies during the battle, or that their mages did. Do you believe me yet? Not yet, but I shall when you tell me how you survived the massacre at Vergen. Oh, they talked about this, yes, how the, um, uh, a soldier in the camp was led out by a priest. Reverend Crest led us out of the fire. He had a magic medallion that protected us from the flames. Many he survived? Zivik's platoon. Zivik, that's Zivik. it. The regiment's best corporal. You have proven that you served in the yes! Dun Banner. 
May I take the standard? Why do you desire it so? It will help me lift a curse. Curses are of no import to me. This one should be. It has stopped King Hensel's army from advancing. The unicorn has returned. He stands at Vergen's gates. With your help, he'll avenge the Dun Banner. The standard lies in the sarcophagus. Take it. You will also find the sword of Colonel Gondor. Now, it is yours. Oh, we've met Thank a guy called Gondor in the Where camp. Where have you left your mind? There are no horses here. True. I would gladly drink with a brother from Brenna, but I am an unfettered soul. Strong drink means nothing. Tastes of nothing. Perhaps I miss that most in death. Mm. Guard the standard. I grasped it firmly even as they cut me down. Ah, mm. uh, soldier's death. Cool. Right, and uh, back across the mist we go. So we've got another sword, the Sword of the Dumb Banner. Oh, they're both steel swords. Okay, that one's better. But the, it can be a crew like, but the Sword of the Dumb Banner. It's kind of cool, though, I have to admit. Uh, so we've got, yeah, but we're saying if we're going to sell that off, we're going to sell it off back at the other side. With actual Hensel's army. Since it would have belonged to their side of the conflict. And also, before we actually do any of the gaming stuff around, I'm going to walk around the camp because I want to talk to see people. And considering all this money I've got now, I'm going to go. What is that that keeps flashing up when I walk past here? Oh, there's some. There you go. Um, I'm going to go sell some stuff and get my new armor. Because it's awesome. Oh, hello, Mr. Spider. There's a spider climbing up my wall, and I was like, oh, hello. Don't go out there, Mr. Spider. Go somewhere else. It just caught me out of the corner of my eye. Just, just a little black thing crawling up the wall. Just like, eh? eh. Sorry, Mr. Spider. You're right down there. Nah, you're fine. He's crawling away. Plenty of little knickknacks and place for him to hide. Alright, so back across the mist. Hopefully, we can now go back across at least. Oh, I genuinely surprised me. I to see you Right, so we've got two markers here for this quest. One, I guess, on the other side of the mist, which we can go that direction. But what's this one? Let's see what this one does. Is this just us saying that we're now leaving? I'll follow it. Well, that cloak came in handy. Whew. Hello. Okay, can't do anything there. Okay, let's try going to the other side then. Do a save for crossing the threshold in the mist and see what's on the other side. It was burned after the siege of uh, Vergen three years back. Right, done a save. Let's hope we can now get across here. Saying, so in theory, I think we can just run across it. Oh, here we go. Reach Hensel's camp. Right, okay. Uh, it's now active. Right. Yeah, look at it. There it is. We're following this thing. It's gone away now. Oh my god! Yeah, sorry, mate. I'm, I'm not really caring about that. Oh, that's a Do 
There's the mist. Yeah, so we couldn't get across if we haven't finished doing the stuff in Vergen. But now we have, so we're good. So where do I go? We don't need to find anybody here. Oh. Ooh. Blue stripes. What have you killed? Nilf Guardians. Good. You're here. The Nilf Guardians attacked us. Any idea why? They were loitering around here, staring into the fog as if waiting for something. I summoned Fenn, Silas, and a few others, and told Vess to cover us from a distance while we went to talk to them. So I asked the black dogs courteously <laughs> why they were gazing into the fog, as if the Emperor himself was about to emerge from it. No answer. But I can see the anger, knitted brows, faces reddening. And they start growling to each other in that dog's tongue of theirs. A woman came out of the mist. You're lovely, aren't you? barely alive. She dropped to the ground and a small object slipped from her hand. It was a jade figurine. No larger than a man's hand. A figurine, if I didn't know it was impossible, I'd say it was Triss turned into a statuette. It is possible. Artifact compression. Where's this woman? I don't know. The girl growled at the soldiers and all hell broke loose. The black ones jumped us and she ran off towards the camp. I need to follow her. We're going with you. Fall in! Well, look like that idea of me doing some of the stuff ain't gonna happen, is it? But to be fair, I'm actually quite glad that uh, we've got Roach with us because he's just a good little lad to come along with these kind of things. So you talk to that elf. Right, well, Roach needs to always get through oh. the door. Do a trade. Saying so you can have these two. Um, actually, no, correction. I'll check. The the. Like unicorn. 32. Yeah, it's. Sorry, that very but right. Sorry, sorry. Not sorry. <laughs> we'll start on the armor, to be fair, very soon. Uh, come on, Roach. Can we talk to you yet? What do you want? Ah, uh, we can. Excellent. I want to talk to the elf. Ah, so we can now get into the Nilfgaard's camp, can we? Not many tents. Is that a boat moving? Oh, it is. We're too late. Is the Percival ready to sail? Percival. It is. Oh, I love they that. not let us go. Hensold has plans of his own. I couldn't give a shit about Hensold. Schillard has Triss, and I need to save her. It's not an option. They'll not let us sail until you lift the curse. And we've no chance of catching the Nilf Guardians on foot. But we know where they they're going. If they wanted to kill her, she'd be dead already. They're going to uh, that Besides thing which, at Loch Muin. know yeah. where they've gone. Loch Muin, Witcher. The monarchs and mages are to meet and decide the fate of the known world. You will find Triss there. I promise. We bloody better. Although I appreciate your help. Thank you very much. Really do appreciate it. Uh, no, we're not going to meet in quite, meet Hensel quite yet. Cause I think we'll get locked into a lot of questing very quickly at that. So I'm going to go talk to the elf. And I'll be around the camp first. Also, oh, is there a tent I can search? There is. Anything else? No, I think we cleared it out. Hmm. Is there anything else? Like over here? No, because we've gone down all that. Ambassador, uh, Ambassador Shiliard Fitz Ordson's first letter to the Emperor. To His Imperial Majesty, the Emperor of Nilfgaard, Emirates of an em Emperor. Emery Van Ely's private and confidential imperial majesty. I have to report the sorcerer 
Uh, Vasimir is indeed proven right that Roll is signed to him. He gets his apprentice Cynthia on a short lease to face nothing appropriate excess ambition. I believe him to be unquestionably loyal to his abilities and more acceptable to serve your Imperial Majesty's objectives. Uh, the summit with the final test, we'll see how it behaves there, and he proves capable of resisting temptations than, than his female colleagues did. Please convey my kindest regard to your consort. Imperial Majesty, blah, 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 blah. Uh, all those mages today. Right, let's just do a quick meditate. Today. So people are actually around in camp. Right, let's go talk to the elf. I'm going to figure out what, this is, what the elf wants to do. Also, I still want to talk to a few of the people around this camp. I haven't got a chance to. How'd you do? No. What do you want? Um. How did you catch him? We didn't. Nothing to boast of, really. We found him, barely alive. He was lying in the ravines among the corpses of other squirrels. Terrible bloodbath it was. As if a mad medic slashed him with a giant scalpel, <laughs> aiming at their arteries, no less. For there was blood everywhere. That sounds like Nasty work. splashes, even high up in the rocks. When was this? Before that ghastly fog appeared. Get anything important out of him? Not really. We salted his wounds, broke his fingers, scorched his feet. And he didn't so much as peep his own name. Tried to bite off his own tongue, in fact. Them elves like a bit of suffering, methinks. <laughs> He's hoping to be rescued. Not likely. Someone massacred him. The whole unit. That's what the royal mages asked him about. Who it was and where they are now. There's no understanding elves. If he answered, we'd hang him quickly. It'd have peace. But he prefers to suffer. Can I talk to him? You're all right. I've heard you've been helping our lads. Talk away, but be quick. If the corporal sees you, he'll have your balls. And ours. Bloody fat girl. What do you want? Information. You from Yorvith's unit? I'm proud of it. <laughs> Yorvith will avenge me. Maybe. I'm responsible for you being captured. I don't understand. I warned Yorvith that the Kingslayer had betrayed him. Your leader's alive because of me. You lie! You're not one of us. Never claimed to be. I'm not interested in your fight, nor in that of the humans. I have my own goals. I'm hunting the Kingslayer and need information. Will you help me? I'd rather not reveal anything to the Dwan. Do you know Elder Speech? The Sermon and Rendon's Hest. Ev de Sala and Mesk of the Mevnuslet. Sayer here. <laughs> yes, well, he is a witcher. He's very good at killing people. I think he just probably assumes you would. The killer elephant in his game. This is more and more so like a new guardian plot. Okay, so you, you don't know where. Well. Can then a day on the hest? Then a near sailor with a sala in Esna Gidirch. Okay, near send in Ell. At the armor, near second year. Elisera. Macian bear hinted fan essert. Said it near Ura Yasen het. Er orcs a gartha saget in it Rodanians. Oh, 
tablets to find that the help. The same as Ruthin, Deren, Hensel, Gerald, Vortel. Then the arm, Elestrea, Hain. Near health. The fail. When Earl Vat Gern Henling can, Nemi saved. Oxen and Sarit est Elekren. Well, Merth Gwynblade Kenneth Bell. Feather a Merth Gwynblade. Say at the step Gathis and Tread Winnes. Vafel. Hmm. Okay, that's a bit of information. That's good. Um, How's service under? See, and okay, it wasn't what I was trying to do. To be honest, I was trying to right. Where is our friend with the beaver skin hat? We don't want no trouble here. Yeah, that's fair enough. Right, actually, let's do this now. What do you want? Richard? Oh, there it is. You must love him. I can see you and the men love your king. He's like a father to us, really. Comes around from time to time. Chats it up, pats you on the mug. Remembers our names too, though you got to earn that in battle. Been so distinguished three times already. Pride myself on it. I'm you sure it's it. a great honor for a humble soldier like yourself. Last time it happened, we was on the march. Some peasant poisoned his well. A few of our lads died. Many others got sick. I path, pass. Half aside that village. <laughs> we hit them so hard we even struck fear into our own boys. They went without a row for two days, and the king was very pleased. <laughs> Came around, gave me a friendly punch in the gut, laughed, and said, You are one true son of a bitch. If you'd not been born among swine, you'd probably be king. <laughs> That's how he is. Humane and all. He's really got a heart. Indeed. I heard there's a man living outside the camp known as the... the oh, we've done it. We, we don't know that. Where else we execution? Wish I could have, but only what she did to the boys. Also, I once saw a soldier raping for three years. Okay. I saw... If so, I'd... Many... I... If there... Alright, fair enough. Uh, I did. The spirits of those who died in battle are now in combat. I want... Oh, the, the fighting started in the afternoon. The Dun Banner was first to attack. We oh, were ambushed, cut off. cut off by then, the bat. Right, yeah. Uh, were you at Brenna? Ah, yes. Cut down more black ones there than anywhere else. The Redanians were in disarray on the left when we joined the battle. Same with the Tamerian regiment in the middle. We arrived just in time. Menno Cohorn <laughs> commanded the Nilf Guardians. He was some leader. So this is where he found out Even we feared him like <laughs> fire. But somehow we prevailed. What happened to him afterwards? He refused to flee. Yeah, he died like many of us. Though no one knows who did it, and no one ever found his corpse. Um what happened before the battle? We forded the Pontar on the third day after the autumn equinox. I remember General Vandegrift and out, but above. Do I? Do I what the dust to the book? Right. Yeah, Somewhere. thank you. Thank you. That's fine. I was saying I didn't so? want to get involved because yes, we've kind of done all that now. It doesn't matter anymore. Right, now this. I would like to get me the black unicorn, please. The Oathbreaker's armor, boots, gauntlets, trousers, and the final sword, virgin. Boom. And we still got a lot of gold left. This works very much for us for our advantage. Right, what can we make, if any, of this yet? Let's start off with the sword. The silver sword, we need. A lot more silver. Got the iron, got the timber, got the dust, and everything is up. Okay, so we should get this get the silver. So what can you sell us? Uh, let's trade. Get us two. That's fine for us. Okay, we need to wait for more, but that's fine. Okay, while we're waiting for that, we can work on something else. Um 
what to, let's start off with the smaller item. So let's start with the other sword, Virgin. Uh, what's the need for that? No, not Virgin, it's the other one. Oh, that was at the top, isn't it? No. Black Unicorn, there it is. Uh, iron, uh, 14, need four more iron, got that, got that, got that, got that, okay, so two more iron. Iron ore, you got two. Lovely, lovely. Okay, what else can we start getting bits off? Um, because armor, how much leather do you need? Robust cloth, studded. And studded leather. Okay, so you have some robust cloth. I'll just, I'll just buy it all. And studded leather. I'll buy it all for now. Um, boots. What do the boots require? Hardened leather. I'll buy some hardened leather then. Right. Let's let's start making some items then. So, uh, let's craft me an item, please. Let's start off with the black unicorn. Um, oh, what? I didn't get the iron? Oh, I, think. I need one more timber. Okay, fine. So, hello. Uh, let's trade. I need you to give me iron, which apparently you don't have, even though it's where I just bought it off you. Hmm. Right. Look, I'm pretty sure there's some iron around here somewhere. Pretty sure if I raise some of these stacks, I will find me some iron. Also, some timber. We need some timber for this. There's two iron. There's some timber. That's fine. So? Uh, I want you to craft me an item. Black Unicorn, please. Boom. First item. Right, let's... Can't do the other bits. Can't do the other sword yet. Don't have enough silver. But we can start with you. With the trousers. Uh, gauntlets. And the boots. Right, what we need you? Need more robust cloth and studded leather. Okay, we can work on that. So, uh, let's try it. Have you got any more of these items in yet? Nah, you don't. Would anybody else have these items? Let's have a ask around. Let's try it. Nope. Holding off doing it, but nah, I see no point in holding off. Do not disturb. I am Myron. Geralt. Geralt. Oh, gotcha. Alright. No, no, don't know for it, Sharon. Let's do some trading. Alright, you're not going to have any of that kind of stuff, I'm guessing. Oh, you got some cloth, actually, so what? Robust cloth? Or. No. Fine. Uh, however, I shall be selling you a ridiculous. Actually, there's no point saying because I got the money. It's because we need weight. Now, search. Uh, I don't really sell too much off until I've got the armor sorted because it might be needed for the armor and I accidentally sell it off. I've done that in the past. Put it away, girl. Relics. Right. Show me what you got. What uh, no, I don't have leather. Hmm. Let's go check outside the camp. Is 
the fact we're so much closer to doing it right now than we were last time when we tried it. It's just like, oh shit, I haven't got enough money to do any of this. Oh. But yeah, you just so much need all the money. All so, oh, that money. It's right, what do you have? I want to stock up on provision. See, can you show fame? He was. I don't know what the good. Any discount? Um. Oh. Mm, never mind. Greetings. Welcome, and they say nobody. A uh, lost. All right. What happens? If crows do not. Good luck. Fortune is easy. I wish you better to ask them. Oh Christ. Uh, let's try it. Trust it when I hear that. Uh, and I don't think that's particularly useful to me right now. And what about this last chap up here? Let's just trade. I've got some nice runes to be fair, so I might I might come back to you once I've got the swords done. Yeah, until that point, yeah, I'm afraid not. Sorry, I didn't mean to switch you though. Right, so I need to find me a load of silver. Do My issue is I just don't have much space in the inventory. Or the other answer to this is a bit of a cheeky one, I accept, is I just sleep until he has all the stuff and buy stuff from him until I have enough. So that we're doing it. It works. Uh, let's trade. Oh, a bus cloth. Oh, what did I need? Okay, because I was—I'm now trying to finish off the main armor. And then the sword. Uh, oh, one more bus cloth. Cool. Studded leather. I don't know any studded leather. I swear I had some. Okay. Okay, so one more bus cloth. Cool. Studded leather. I'll have all eight of that, please. Zero out of eighteen. I swear I have some studded leather. <laughs> yeah, I got. Okay, I felt that's it. And I definitely need at least three silver, so I'll take that. Right, let's cool. have a quick check in the actual uh, crafting. So. Uh, that's the main armor. Ah, that's fine. Okay, missing four. That's fine. And the sword. Um, eight off on the silver. I was saying, he'll have some more stuff. Also, too fat. I want to sell some stuff anyway. So, uh, let's trade because I was saying, I've not got much gold left now because I've already done that stuff. I'm keeping that valuable figurine. I want it. I like it. It's valuable, damn it. Um. <laughs> Oh, that's right. I don't care about having, but it's quite funny. Like this, that's all. Oh, it's great. Uh, Harpy claws. I think don't need that. Don't really need it. Really need... I don't need. Pretty sure I don't need just cloth for the armor. No, it's a bus cloth. Okay, cool. So, I'm going to go and sell my cloth. Uh, uh, thanks for you. Oh, right, yeah, okay. So, oh, Christ, got loads of stuff. Right. Don't sell off that. Sell that. Sell that. Don't sell these. At all. Good God. Oathbreaker. 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 Bloody keep them. Right. Has this guy got his stuff back yet? Yeah, he does restock every so often. Hardened leather. No. Don't want hardened. 
Right, let's do the cheeky then. Come here, let's meditate for pretty much 24 hours. So? Now let's trade stuff. I don't own any extra stuff yet. God damn you! I want some more silver! But I can't put all this up wrong because it won't be able to take the effect. Oh. God damn it. And now I can't even find the form of the damn thing. There it is. Oh, that's shiny. Okay, I can't create silver, that's the big thing. But in theory, I can actually create... Oh, pardon me, studded. That's an extra bit. Okay, so no. I don't need half another for it. You have half another, don't you? How many studded do I need? I need, I need four more studded. So that's eight. So a hard and leather. That's right. Eight. All right. No that. Come on. No, we're having conversation. So let's uh, let's craft me an item. Studded leather. And then boom. Just about for us to make it. Cool. And I'm saying I'm now I'm still uh, need that as the last thing I need. And I'm missing six silver. I just pushed them around the place because I could. Because you've robbed me as far as I'm concerned. That's right. Um, nah, I'm keeping all these. Bloody hell. Um. Okay, this is now purely to make money because I need to have some cash. Let's sell off that many. That. Uh, Arby's Liver, let's sell a few of those. Mandrake Root, let's sell a few of those. So I need 200 to make it, let alone have any the stuff for it yet. And so I just sell off a few bits and bobs. Chance he got some silver. <laughs> oh, he, he, he definitely does restock his stuff. I know he does. <laughs> right. Right, that's. Well, that's all spread out. Game thing, just give it a minute. I know I still have stuff to steal from generally around the camp. On the red, straw for green. The enemy have fed you. So I don't sell off my uh, silver and the other bits of all my for the sword. I should be really alright in selling most stuff off. Especially all the timber. But I think I've made a couple of bits of wood to make the armor, but not much. Just make the sword even. What about you? Are you going to tell me anything interesting? Right, drop the pick. Oh, yeah. 
does the sword cost us anything to make wood wise? Is it version or is it earth breaker? No, it is version. Silver sword. Um, couple of timber. Okay, so sell all but two. And also Hello. the iron, since we don't need the iron, for sure. So? Uh, let's trade, please. Um. Okay, you can have that cloth, definitely. You can have a couple of these stones, also, to be fair. Oh, uh, you can have some hide. You can have some jaws. You can have some of these. This won't make money. You just sell off all your bloody stuff. And so, definitely, definitely need all those. You need some, but not all. Water, once again. Iron. Oh, okay, let's check it. Do we need any iron to make this sword? Silver, we need two iron. Okay, fine. So don't quite sell all of it off, but sell off a good amount. There. Um, leather. We literally don't need any leather. Timber, this is one thing, yep. Why we definitely don't need half of that. Andy, how do you have that? He will at some point. Silver raw, two more. Oh, it's two at a time, is it? It's ten. Not to ten, we need two more lots of that. Surprise! They have a hand in every rebellion, every evil cause. You know me, I'm not prejudiced. Well, I don't get it. What's wrong with those non-humans? Ah. Greetings. Well, if you'd felt oppressed, mate, maybe you'd have a different opinion on the entire subject. Looking for... Uh, no, actually, I was just picking up all this wood. Because I can. In short. All right, let's go to the upper camp. I know there's some stuff in the upper camp we can steal. I just love the casual stealing in this game. Just like, ah, oh, I walk in somebody's tent. Oh, it's outside. Mine now. Also, to be fair, with any luck, we might also get a little bit. Think picks up any silver from that. Oh, this is like the king's thing. Overlooking his wonderful subjects. Weapons. Even weapon that? That's not bad. It's not great. Damn it! This is a brothel, not a military camp. Ah, uh, the Knights of Flaming Rise. We'll talk to you in a moment. Once so I've finished plundering the supply stores. <laughs> it's kind of nice to know actually, once we kind of done all, like, got all through this stuff, we don't really care too much about a lot of the stuff we're in crafting. So, it, yeah, a lot of it can go. Not all of it, but a lot of it can. Right. The Knight of the Flaming Rose, here. Geralt of Rivian. Terror. I've long wait. <laughs> Come on, come here. I 
don't want to kill you, you just decided you wanted to fight. And I'm still pissed off because I saved Siegfried in the last game, he's alive. So there. <laughs> Toss a coin to your witcher. Bum, so? bum, 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 bum. Straight. Silver raw. Three. Oh, you're teasing me. Pretty sure we need like, uh, what? Like two more or something. Or one more. <laughs> one more. Oh, you're a massive tease. Oh, one more. Oh, you're an ass. Oof. Have the falchion. Alright, what else you got here? Nothing in particular. He killed two kings. You think he can't handle it? I wonder actually well, we haven't we haven't spoken to um Roach since the whole going down with all of that business in the black ones. So let us go. And hopefully when we come back we'll have the one last steel a uh, silver we need. And we'll have a new set of swords. It'll be amazing. Life can be really strange. Yes, life can be awesome strange. Has Vesk got anything to say about life? No. He was slaughtering pigs at the time. Oh, so he takes a pig's eye and puts it between his buttocks. He does what? Puts a pig's eye in his ass. The elder and the recruiter enter, and the mother says, Son, they've come to take you to war. And he's standing with his back to them, his pants down. He spreads his cheeks and says, I can see that. Did they take him? Not a chance. Well, I guess it works to a certain extent. Oh, valuable trinket. No, nothing to talk to you about. That's a great shame. A super soldier serum, or what? Hey, there are. One more silver, that's all I need. Oh, this is coming tedious. Although it's still not as bad as a lot as, as I was saying when I died, tried this last time and it's just like, come on, come on, come on. I'll run out of gold. No! Uh. And once I've got it, I've got the I've got all the stuff complete, I'll sell those of like I'll sell off my old kit. So? Uh hello, breakfast tree. Yes! You got my silver. Right. So? Craft me an item. Boom. Right. Virgin. Black unicorn. Oathbreaker, 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 Oathbreaker. The Blasphemer's armor is no more, guys. We're on to the Oathbreaker stuff. And, ooh, Garrow. Looking fine and swanky. Do we do we have the Black Vision still? Oh, yeah, we do. Okay, that's fine. I'm happy with that. So, just to clarify, that's definitely all these items. So, Blasphemer. You're the Blasphemer, sir. Blasphemer, Blasphemer, Blasphemer. Cool. Now, come here, my good man. So? Because now you are going to be the proud owner of all of this. Use it well. And also some more stuff. Because I'm going to sell some stuff. Uh, yeah, don't care about all this now. Eyes oh, for things. I could do potion. Cloth. She don't give a damn. Diamond dust. That's still off some of it. Uh, Jonah's brain bits. 
So I don't want to completely sell everything off, I want to keep a few bits in there. Stock. Iron is too common, just go away. Leather, sell it all. Timber, sold off. Swine, less. Oh, look at the weight I've saved from that. It's awesome. And 900 gold, which is really good. Now, let's see what I can upgrade these also briefly. Um, because I did find it will shrink it. Oh, okay, fine. Yeah, come oh. back. Let's try. You can have the trinkets. Now, uh, enhancements. Uh, what was I saying? Fire on that. Uh, now, nah, fire is a good one. Fire rune. 5% incineration. On a blade that we does that. Yeah. Boom. 34 to 47 damage. 35 to 45. It's silly. Um, you can also accept some stuff. So I'm going to... Okay, so... Just poisoning. That's bloody good. The plus two. I'm looking at the plus twos in particular. Because you're only plus one. So I'm definitely preferring lots of stuff. So it's plus... So I've actually got three here, so that'll give me that, and then resistance to incineration, that's really good. Yeah, sod it. Enhance. 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 Up to 36 from 21, that's awesome. Right. We have all our new kit and our new swords, and they are swanky as fuck. Gonna save. Let us go talk to Death Mold first, and then hand so because Death Mold is going to say. Just like look at our new kid. Our kid is amazing. Oh, it's great to have new kid. Hey, Death Mold. Um. Spoken to the king yet? Indeed, he was delighted to hear he can be cut from the curse. Great because I need the medallion of the priest known as Crest. I heard it's in Henselt's possession. <laughs> He'll give you nothing until you free him from the curse. Truthfully, I believe I understand him. You have a good chance of perishing when you confront the Draugrs. Give me a break, Deathmold. The two of you are just afraid I'll leave this entire mess in your hands. Ah, that is something I do not fear at all, for I know exactly why you're here. As for the king, you may curse him and scold him and call him a fool if you wish, though it's not something I would advise. <laughs> No, I give you that. Kings tend to be quite well. Hmm. Learn anything new about the curse? A mage on the other side of the fog is also probing the battlefield. A sorceress. How do you know? You shall know them by the fruit of their spells. Magic differs with the brain type that generates it. The female mind is simply laid out differently. It could be Triss. No, but no, it's, it's someone far more powerful. See you. Cool. Eilhart. And Sabrina Glevesig. King Henselt awaits you, Witcher. Hey, Henselt. At last. Have you got Sabrina's spear? Indeed Not I do. That. I've got all three artifacts. You won't regret it. Let's do some magic. She died here. And pissed and shattered she did. Evil place. You can feel it in the air. Those candles don't help any either. They've gone mad. Someone said the bitch died a martyr, and now the common folk burn candles for her. I have to observe this place from a distance. During the execution, I was on that hill. I'll show you. Yeah, we've already examined this site before. Uh, now, there's one thing I need to make sure I remember is it's his Deathmars Grimwald. So it's this kind of thing we need to form. But with the magical salt that effectively we're going to sprinkle on the ground, that's my understanding of it. So. Hmm. Alright, hands up, coming up. You know, for a warrior king, you're a little bit slow, aren't you, mate? Nope. 
flat area. That's good. Are you concerned for your feet? Your Majesty, you need to draw runic protective signs around the stake. Magic signs are the domain of witches, not kings. Correct me if I'm wrong. It's important that you draw the circle yourself, Your Majesty. Important for whom? It was your death, Sabrina foretold. So who do you think? All right. Tell me what we do. To lift the curse, we have to reenact the events from three years ago. How do you wish to do that if half of those involved lie rotten with the worms? It's about the energy of that time. The energy of the woman who cast the curse, combined mm. with the energy of its victim. <laughs> when you get the runic signs right, Sabrina's ghost will appear. Bring the bitch to life. It'll be a pleasure to put my spear in her. Remember but... to stab her in exactly the same yeah, spot not, as that not, soldier. Yeah, not, not your fleshy spear, mate. Before the sorceress completes the curse. I look for the hole. But how am I to know when? When you realize that the curse concerns you. But be ready. She may use a different name. Is that all? For you. Then I take over. Spectres might appear during the exorcism. Might or will? It depends on Sabrina's aura in the spirit world. Well, I'll wager ghosts loathe the cunt. Let's get it over with. Tell me what I am to draw. You have to go down there, Your Majesty. What about you? I'll guide you. I have a good view from up here. Right, so this is the thing we got to draw from death from death from, uh back in moment. How do we then oh I see, so we are engaged in this conversation. Right, cool. So So he's think he's standing there. So I think he's in the pixie ring. Black candles is what's in front of us. Scorched tree is on the far side. Uh, goat skull is over there. Raven's corpse. Oh, it's there. Sour milk, stone bowl, petrified bread. Ah, petrified bread. Yeah, uh, that went up higher. Uh, oh, I see. Right. So back. Back. So what's this thing? What's the exact. Um, right, so we're going to go up, down, up, to, okay, okay, so let's go towards the bread. Pour the powder towards the petrified bread loaf, your majesty. Then we're going to come down to the black candles. Head towards the black candles, your majesty. Then I believe that's the goat skull. Now go towards the goat skull, your majesty. There. Then to the tree. On the far side. Down, down, hands up. Uh, Scorch tree. Now towards the burnt tree. Raven skull. Find the raven's corpse, your majesty. Find the raven's corpse. <laughs> I can so imagine the head his head just like, what the fuck am I doing here for this bloody witch? Uh, sour milk. Now spread the powder and head for the stone bowl. And finally the pixie circle. Go towards the pixie ring, your majesty. Sire, form a large, even circle at a good distance from the pyre. It's turned out beautifully. Pity the wind will soon scatter it. The evil power of the curse came from the fire. Fire's a hard element to tame, and this one had added potency. It consumed the body of the one casting the curse. Enough of these phantasmagorias, as Death Lord puts it. Look at my boots. Stay yeah. in the circle, Your Majesty. The powder reeks of... Dwarven dung. <laughs> Do I just cast a bit of fire in it? Oh no, it's very specific. Right, that's what I was saying. I'm going to get this cut out. 
I admit, like, the fact he brought, like, two soldiers, and, like, they're not, they're only from, like, his personal guard. Ah, uh, right. Hey, Sabrina. You have some brave soldiers, Your Majesty. They're scared of ghosts, as we all are. Curses, there's hundreds of them! Calm down, Your Majesty. We're protected by the magic runes. The ghosts won't get past the barrier. I'm not afraid of people, but those plowing creatures have begun to bother me. You're safe if you stay within the runes. What should I do? When the sorceress calls your name, you have to show mercy and end her suffering with the spear. You've broken the surface. Spectres to get through. What shall we do? I'll take care of them. You finish the exorcism, Your Majesty. Curse you, Henselt! Henselt! By blood and fire! Let it be so by blood and fire! Yet a shooting star split the heavens and work its mortal journey with a trail of blood! Let fools be choked by the sight of fish scales turned by magic into square pieces of gold! Oh, that's Good boy. <laughs> it worked. Are you sure? All I can say for sure is that a dwarf can pass between a troll's legs, even on tiptoe. But I think it went well. Good. For me and for you. But all the worse for Edern. I've separated you from the curse, but it remains active and powerful. The Spectres of the Fallen continue to fight in the fields outside Vergen. You'll find a way, like you did with that charcoal slot. That'll be much harder. I have faith in you, and faith can move mountains. Mm -hmm. Funny you say that. I need an artifact symbolizing faith. Yes, Death Mole told me. I'll medallion. give you the medallion. First, Good. I must have a drink. Come to my tent. I'll roll out my best wine. You deserve it. Yeah, that works for me. I don't, I don't, I don't mind getting paid, and but you know, at the same time, wouldn't mind to get some actual pay. As soon as you kill that troll, actually, thinking about it, go to King Hunter. Oh, I shall. Uh, I might very quickly see how I can kill that big fuck off troll. What is worth it? I forgot about it for a while. Oh, 
that's a relatively easy curse easy curse to look out. I think I think the issue is like the curse itself, it's it's like it's the know how, it's the knowledge, that's what you pay for almost when you hire a witcher. You know, sure, it, they'll they'll definitely get the jobs on, but it's like you know, it's not the actual you know, it's it's what they know that gets it done rather than action, the action itself. Not everyone will know you need to do this and that to kill some kill one thing. Just a curse. So what is yeah, because I know there was a troll in this direction. Just a question of is he still active and is he still gonna murder the fuck? Murder murderize me. I don't know. Okay, there was a troll in one of these. Wasn't any further up, because that's the mist. Oh, you can do it. Okay, maybe it's gone, the troll. I don't know up here it was... The hut on that side. Yeah, maybe the troll's gone. Maybe it's a different type of day? Maybe it, oh no. Alright, let's go to King Hearts I sent. Good boys, blue stripes, keep doing your thing. I do love their tents. I wish I had a tent as big as that. That'd be so cool. So I can definitely tell with the new armor that it, I I didn't take nearly as much damage. It wasn't still still wasn't killing a particularly quick men, but no slower than before either. Definitely it's a new sword, isn't it? Silver sword, virgin, thirty-five to forty-five, which is ridiculous. Well, it's pretty high damage. Next sword, I want starting at fifty. No, sixty. All the damage. Oh, Redanian! Greetings, whoever you are. Oh, hey! These are Redanians. It's a trust, Redania. The king is occupied. Return after sundown. Sundown. Okay. Uh, okay. Let's play. Let's spend some character points. We've got two to spend. What do we want to spend it on? Do we want to put any more on this tree? Uh, lots of abilities, drink an additional potion. Uh, damage reduction when poisoned, plus 10%. Damage dealt. Uh, okay, that's a we were, we know, We're putting some points into this street, weren't we? Um, yeah, I like that actually. Quen. Yeah, let's do that. Use Quen a lot more. Oh, duration is up. That actually is amazing. Uh, Quen transfers damage to multiple targets. Some of the times. Ooh, yes, yes, I'll have that. Right after sundown, so let's meditate. Let's just go for midnight. It's a nice evening. Let's go for. Uh, oh, Redanian is still here, but the guards are asleep. Damn it! This is a bra. I'm glad you're here. A messenger from Adania arrived this morning. Read. The king of Redania, Radovid V, son of Vizima and Hedrig from Malior, the heir... Get to the point. The point is, it's not true that after the death of King Foltest, Temeria will be inherited. In truth, Foltest left a lawful heir. Who is this heir? Queen Ada, daughter of King Foltest and wife of Radovid. Yeah. Adar. Everyone knows she was the fruit of incest. If my memory serves, Geralt, she's under a curse, isn't she? Um. That was true. Foltest's daughter was a striga, but I managed to lift the curse, or else Radovid wouldn't have wed her. It appears you removed that curse twice. Third time lucky. Mm -hmm. Third, fourth. Maybe 15th. 
Ada could yet save her human flesh again. Tell King Radovid that I will not honor a monster with a royal title. If Redania doesn't wish, what the hell's going on? Guards! Uh, oh. Witcher, I can see his medallion. <laughs> wow, that was not me. Where are all your guards? Seriously, this is a king's camp and there are not more. Where are they? <laughs> Rethink your fighting stance, Geralt. There's two of them. Right. Shield time. Oh, that's cool. Yes, cut down, slice and diced. <laughs> Good, there are some actual soldiers that are paying attention. Who are they? They wanted to kill me. Me! <laughs> the scum. The scum. Witcher, we must talk. Yes, we bloody Death must. Death said you needed this medallion. You saved my life, and I'm not nearly as ungrateful as some might say. You'll receive the pendant in due time. Pity none could be taken alive. Don't fret, Tanzerville. There are ways to make a dead man speak. Oh. I know those methods. Necromancy is forbidden. In the absence of the council and the conclave, it's hard to know what is forbidden. <laughs> what would you say, oh. Your Majesty? I want to know everything. Plow that corpse if you have to. Do anything it takes. Necromancy, Your Majesty, is a branch of magic. I don't care. Do as you're told. <laughs> Count me out. Do as you're told. Love it. <sighs> as the common folks say, be at ease, the woman's gone. I'll need your help, Witcher. You know where to find me. It's never ending. I'm the bloody king, but she mumps and sulks like some common servant was trying to grope her. Not every sorcerer is like Death Mold. Many don't like messing with corpses. Mm, as yeah, long as she's tools. in my camp, she'll do as I say. And what do you Go. say? Death Mold is probably biting his nails in anticipation. Yeah, he's a little bit weird about all this stuff, isn't he? Oh, Death Mold isn't what it usually is. Okay, where is Death Mold then? Solve the uh, case of the Kingsway and return to the medallion. Okay, cool. So, is this, so I'm guessing from the way they were fighting, I'm guessing they're a Witcher. I'm pretty sure they're a Witcher. One of, uh, what's his name's little friends? Ah. Nice. Hey. Uh, oh, that's a nice cut on the face. Jesus. Geralt of Rivia, ready for the ride of your life. Um. Can't handle this without me. You're a mutant, like this killer. An ordinary man would never survive Han Marvin's blue dream. You must drink a potion that will increase your heart's efficiency and strengthen your blood vessels. Hallucinogenic properties are also welcome, as they will enhance the vision. Gadwall should do it. Hazard Necromancy's awfully fishy. What do you aim to Gadwall. do? Gadwall. Han Marvin's Blue Dream is a spell that grants you a glimpse of a dead man's memories. You'll see, feel, and taste what the killer experienced in his life. 
As a mutant, the operation isn't at all dangerous for you. I need to do something before we begin. Have a drink, plow a girl, do something to relax. Whatever it takes. I was going to meditate it to us and get some Kazuchi or some Gadball. Yeah, I don't know how to make Gadball. So I need to go and find out how to make Gadball for this? Potentially. Where is um, you? That's trade. You might know. Gadwall. Okay. Generation. So, what's the benefits of this potion? I'm trying to get it. So, it's a increase in generous damage. Ah, I see. Alright. All right, well, I'll have that. Cheers. Alchemy. Might as well make a couple of gabbles. Also, let's just restock some of these. Da -da 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 -da. Uh, rook, yes, definitely rook. Swallow, why the hell not? Um Toy out, yes. Yes. Wolf, yes, I want lots of wolf. Especially now because I can drink more potions, it's definitely worth me having all these things. Right. I need to have a drink. Do I drink do I okay, do I do I have this potion first? Let's have the potion first. Let's, let's no, I can have this. Let's drink the potion. Gadball. Right. I'm ready. Wonderful. Blue Dream can be very useful, although it only lets you see the killer's recent past. Hope it's worth it. Pay attention to every detail. Places, names, everything. Got it. Let's begin! Vekina Zanzala! Oh. By the way, his face be really fucked up. Oh. And everything faded to white. I nearly got lost in that fog. Look at it this way. Nobody will find us here. Unless Henselt attacks Bergen despite the mist. Hensel's not going to attack anyone ever again. Always the optimist, Ox. Oh. <laughs> So it's always interesting to play a character which is, isn't, uh, you know, Garrow. Where are we going? I'm Ox. Yeah, I recognise these bits of the canyons. Go. Oh. Got distracted for a moment. I guess I really can't really die at this point. That's particularly This door I couldn't open, of course. Following my 
footsteps. I love these traps. I know, I do too. Hensel behaves as if he wants to help us. What do you mean? You've seen him. He loves playing the soldier. He's everywhere. He's reckless. Let the Ulanum assassinate him like the others. Finally, some action. We've been skulking in these caves like bats. I'd rather be like a bat than slain by the king's mercenaries. What is it, Ox? Scared? I heard Deadbolt never lets Hensel out of his sight, and now a witch is arriving again. One of him, three of us. Hey. But you know who it is. I know, damn it, but don't let it get to you. It's Triss Marigold who worries me. If she betrays that Sheila ordered us to get rid of Demerbend, things will get out of hand. Oh. Letho should kill her. He should, but apparently he only kills kings. <laughs> Hey, Aletha. Here at last. They're guarding the camp like it was a princess's chastity. Did you learn anything? The White Wolf has arrived at the Kedwedi camp with Vernon Roach. Looks hmm. like he's Hensel's lackey now. I'd rather Hensel used others as his lackeys. <laughs> I thought he was hanged for killing Foltest. You want him hanged? No. We have to be careful. Especially now we've broken off with Yorbeth and his bunch. There's something else. Sheila de Tanzerville. Sheila. Our sorceress is playing hard. De Tanzerville has done her job. We don't need her anymore. We won't kill her. Not just yet. You know best. That's right. So who the, the hell are you working for? Because obviously you obviously you soon. tried to convince what some people a lot of people that you were work, you're doing their me. bidding, but actually it's the other way around. Where things will be decided. Lovely. Meet again soon, if you're careful. To drink a oh jug God. of wine and laugh about it? Who knows? Hmm. <laughs> Interesting. I'll take the palisade. We'll meet by the cave Ooh. entrance. Ooh. I heard you stashed some of the duty in the caves near the camp. What the Are hell you? is this? You want everyone else to know? I don't know who told you. Are we you oh, it's the sneaky, there. sneaky music. Is it a deal? Fuck, I suppose so. Well, go tell the others. Where are we going? Oh, I don't know where I'm going. Oh, no. Something's gone wrong. I don't know what's happened now. Nope. No idea what happened there. Wake up. I'm dying to hear everything. What did you find out? Uh, Sheila's helping They said them. Sheila de Tanzerville was an accomplice in the murder. murder. Yeah. Sheila? She was here while you were lying in a trance. She said she'd follow the second assassin. Do you remember anything else? They're hiding in the ravines. The other ones probably fled there. Our dead man should have a key on him. Do you remember anything else? There's no time to waste. I'll follow them. Good luck, Geralt. Yeah, I think there was more to that, but I fucked up sneaking. Oh, that's a shame, but there it is. So it is. Have I now got the key? Well, there's nothing to pick up from him, so I guess we're good. Right, go to this King Slayer's hideout. See so what I can find. Maybe Sheila, maybe it's time now to face another sorcerer, and a powerful one at that. Indeed it can be. 
into the ravines I go. Ah, oh, no, wrong way. That's the way to the um, <clears throat> creepy house on the cliffs. These are like the actual bodies we killed, harpies we killed, and in the like, in that, in the vision. That's kind of cool. Right, now, lots of traps, remember. Lots and lots and lots of traps. Oh, what the hell is that? Exploding things to deal with. Bloody. Right. Go on, Garrett, touch the medallion. So I know that they're down that way, but what's down that way? I'm intrigued now. Find out. Can this door be opened? No, it's locked. Okay, and it's okay. If it says locked, it's locked, locked. Like uh, sometimes it will say you require a key. If it requires a key, you actually can get each other out of the key right now. Because it's locked. It's it's uh, locked. Or the of it. Hello, gorgeous. I swear someone said my name. Is it? Oh! Seret. Sheila knew. She wants to destroy the evidence. <laughs> what evidence? We didn't want to leave you. What are you talking about? Nearly made it. Just think. The wild hunt. We could have freed the world of the omen of war. <laughs> Famous witches forever if you had managed that one. Oh, flashback time. Oh, brooding girl. Love it. September 13th, 1269, oh. the Ravine of the Hydra. Following the peace of Sintra, 53 officers of the Vryhead Brigade were brought here and executed, their throats cut. The elves' bodies were dropped into the chasm. I don't know what the riders of the hunt were looking for. 
November 23rd, 1269. Sintra, the village of Coldwater, and another victim of the hunt. An 11-year-old boy, his parents didn't even ask if he had a chance. I'm tired. February 24th, <laughs> 1270, the high pass in the Armouche Mountains. An Imperial Manticore, one of the world's oldest and deadliest monsters. I used to feel excitement at moments like this. Now the beast is only an obstacle on my way. Its meat and hot blood will help me survive this icy hell. <laughs> May 30th, 1270, the Ruga River. The hunt continues to race south. Since I've been following them, they've taken 23 individuals, all between the ages of 10 and 20. All except for Yennefer. Garrow hunting. So, what do we get? We got uh, a long time. Ago. Oh, this is about the the armor. Uh, it says the attorney bank that yeah, yeah, the armor. Cool. Okay, let's pull it right. Notes. Notes of the king's learning. Sit it. He seems different, but in reality is so similar. Our paths have been the same. We survived the trials, endured the same training, and the same so many monsters that we no longer keep count. So many men also. The difference is the detail. Uh, when I see him moving in combat, I want to laugh, but I also see just as just he is just as effective, if not more so. There is, however, one critical difference. I cannot describe adequately. He has a goal. He is committed to something. He doesn't wander the world as if blown about by the wind. But he feels emotion at a level I can't entertain. Yet these emotions are not typical, not not typically human, as if an illness unkind. I think he tithers on the brink of instinct and emotion. It's used a lot of energy to maintain the main his mental health. I hope we get a chance to know him better and learn from him. Nothing specific, just life and a sword. The negotiator. It's not bad. Oh, the plus threes and bleeding is awesome, but it's just not as pretty nice as my pretty, pretty soot. Speak with Death Mold. Yeah. Yeah, Death Mold's going on about this, alright. Shall I? Oh, yeah, Sheila, she's a bitch. Just a confirmed. The traps in the way are slightly useless in the sense that, like, they don't do enough damage. The way out. I think we must be pretty near actually going striving to lift the curse of this place. Off the actual uh, field. So we might stop at relatively soon and just and have that as the next episode of going right time to lift this curse, bitches. Boom. <laughs>
Look what the cat dragged in. Oh, Did you get him? Sheila got to him first. He's dead. The bitch! She's probably on the other side of the mist by now. Come on, Witcher. We've got to remove that damn curse. I got the medallion from the king, the one you were looking for. Right, so I'm thinking this is the point that we are actually pretty much ready to actually lift the goddamn curse. And that's probably going to be a fairly long chunk. And so I think I will probably end it here for tonight. It's been a, oh, been a pleasure playing the game as always. And I'll hope to see you next time. Till then, bye-bye.